ladies and gentlemen, Ladies and gentlemen, we bring in the world closer to your doorstep.
subsidy remover and as he proposed a wage award and a fresh twist as DSS invites suspended EFCC chairman Bauer for questioning <laughs> it's interesting you know and why did Tinobu suspend Bauer as EFCC boss it looks like Tinobu is uh, on the rampage, you know, making sure that whatever I think that was going on wrong there at the time, he's trying to deal with it. But like I said, we're going to be telling you more about all that as we gear ourselves this morning to bring you the updates from Nigeria with Mr. Laimi Koike. Welcome your way from Star Radio UK. Okay, 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 okay. Yes, uh, as you know, I tell you all the time that the, the program will not be void of music. So as and when uh, we have any breaks, I'll try to I do my best to bring you some lovely tunes this morning. But now, it is my singular honor to once again invite or welcome the white lion himself uh mr olayomi koiki in the house and let me say yummy good morning well a very good morning to you uh in the studio and i hope you can hear me loud and clear loud and clear loud and clear how are you doing sir well uh we give thanks uh, as we uh always say uh when we are live uh been listening to you before coming into the conversation uh, you know, the most important thing is, you know, there's a lot happening around the world. So we just have to be very grateful when we are still here, you know, uh, existing and hoping that there won't be another third world war that would eventually lead to human catastrophe. But for now, uh, we give thanks and we are back again on the Star Radio UK Network as we continue with um, the most populous black nation, they say, Nigeria, that has a huge stake when it comes to part of the 193 countries around the world today. Well, listeners, it is Star Radio UK. It is your favorite African and Caribbean radio station in London. Uh, with the time, eight minutes past the top of the hour. But let's go straight. Uh, let me acknowledge uh, the banjo Sunday. He says, free, free, our freedom fighter now. Hashtag Igboho Osha, uh, Igboho Osha. Free, Namidikano, uh, now. Okay, um, they are freedom fighters, and I know people have been calling for their freedom, but I think the president is doing something extraordinary. But before we come to that, let's go to um, what was discussed on Niger Voices yesterday. Yomi. Hello, Yomi. Yes, uh, yesterday was a, was a beautiful day, you know. Uh, it was the Niger Voices, and it is still uh, Niger Voices. So uh, yesterday, uh, we went back to review uh, the three weeks. Uh, some say it's too early to cut the shot. Uh, we need to give maybe another three months or six months before we can start discussing you know, dollar amethyst. A couple of things that we touched on yesterday is what he has done up to three weeks. And uh, by the time we were leaving the Star Radio UK, uh, also... Uh, you know, the EFCC has also removed, uh, you know, the chairman as well. So it seems, uh, you know, after Tinobu inauguration on the 29th, uh, we went into uh, what we called the subsidy, which triggered, you know, the petrol hike, the, you know, the petrol strike. That almost triggered a full-scale protest in Nigeria. But as we speak right now, it seems that is a little bit, you know, stable because the Nigerian Liberal Congress is still discussing, you know, with Bola Tinobu and the rest as well. Uh, and also, as that was also almost coming, uh, we also realized that the CBN uh, as also uh, part of those that have destabilized the country. But as we speak right now, the currency is floating according to the private sector economics. Uh, back CBN as the NERA continued to a little bit fall. Yesterday was just about uh, 750 to 755. So we also talked about the, you know, those that are agitating. Is Bola Tinobu going to, at some point, sit down with them, negotiate? Uh, as many Nigerians say, the 1999 constitution does not have the clause for the referendum. But uh, if Mali, 
a country of 21 million uh, on the 18th of this month will be changing over either yes or no a new constitution that literally means that the 1999 constitution can also be brought down and allow a legitimate referendum included and decide whether those that still want to remain as part of Nigeria will do so. Also, we talked about the student loan, which has been whether Nigerians will be able to get in some of the criteria to apply for that student loan. So that was the discussion on the Star Radio UK on the Niger Voices Network yesterday. Well, listeners, Mr. Laimi Koike on a summary of what was discussed on the Niger Voices. And as I do say all the time, now, if you missed out on it, please, 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 next week, God willing, once he comes on, don't, gotta, don't miss out on it at all. Because he's going to be telling you more about all that next week. All right, then. Um, let's now come to the substantive issue that is going on here. Now, did the president fire the EFCC uh, boss, Bauer? Well, uh, it has always been that it's going to happen, but how soon is what we don't know. But what we were told, uh, I mean, this was uh, somebody appointed by the former president, uh, Muhammad Buhari, uh, is a very young man, uh, you know, whether uh, is right qualified for the job, because we know that nepotism played a very huge role when it comes to appointment with the former president, uh, Muhammad Buhari. But Bawa has now had a meeting with uh, with Tinobu. Uh, he's the one on the right hand side. You can see that he's a very young man, uh, you know, uh, and he's been working. But it seems that uh, the time has catch up with him. And what we can now confirm that he's currently being held just as uh, a Mefili in the custody of the DSS. But one thing is, um, he had his last meeting with Bola Tinobu. From what we were told. Maybe he was not even aware that uh, Ibu Yerin is uh, is a remover on the National Television Authority called NTA. The Department of the State Services, DSS, has now arrested the suspended chairman of the Economic and Financial Crimes Commission, known as the EFCC, Abdul Rashid Bawa. Bawa arrived at the headquarters of the DSS just at about so many past 2100 hours yesterday. According to the sources, he's currently being grilled by the operatives of the secret police. You might be asking, why could the DSS be grilling the former EFCC? He also has a baggage of an uh, allegation, according to, uh, you know, just before Tinubu was coming uh, as the president. But the spokesman of the DSS, Peter Afunaya, confirmed Bauer present in a statement. The Department of the State Services has invited Mr. Abdul Rashid Bauer. Uh, you know, to their custody. The invitation relates to some investigative activities concerning him, according to Afunaya. So it seems that Tinobu is going after them one at a time. Who is the next person to be suspended? Is still in the leaves. I say maybe Buratai, the ambassador representing Nigeria in Benin Republic. Remember, it was one man that had multiple allegations, being the former chief of army staff, where billions of Naira got missing while it was the chief of staff and protecting as many of Nigerians in his position. Wow. But I don't know what Tinubu is going to be doing. We have to wait for him. Well, we have to wait for him. Uh, and the moment he, he fires somebody, then the DSS goes after him. He fired MFL, and the next day the DSS goes after So who next, uh, uh, as Yomi has said, will be telling you more about that. Bishop Adesina, good morning to you. Uh, he's giving us some breaking news. The tallest man in Nigeria named Afiz Agoro has died. May he so rest in perfect peace. How tall was he? Well, 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 Bishop, if you can feed us with that information, that would be very, very wonderful. But listeners, it is Star Radio UK. It is the Wednesday, uh, Thursday edition. Why am I saying Wednesday? Because I wanted another Niger Voices. Don't you worry. It will come next week. Um, uh, it's the Thursday edition of the morning show. I am I'm with Mr. Olayomi Koike. Now, let's come to the CBN. We're going to talk about the CBN. Now, we have information coming through that the Central Bank of Nigeria has directed deposit money banks to remove the rate cap on the Naira at the official investors and exporters window of um, of the exchange market to allow for a free float of the national currency against the dollar and other global currencies. Is it something that is going to help 
um, the Naira appreciate against the dollar, or is it going to now cause the Naira to fall further down? Yummy. Um, maybe we should just give you a bit of background of that tallest man, and we move straight into mm -hmm, uh, mm -hmm. you know the dollar, uh, which is uh, you know the money being used by so many Nigerians when it comes to um, you know our relationship with the world. Uh, even though that is in right there, you can see. Uh, but what do we know when it comes to you know the age, the size? Uh, Aziz Afiz Aguru Oladimeji uh, is seven feet four inch height. Restricted him from finding even love, uh, according to the information. Uh, it was born on 13th of December 1975. But from the news coming out now, it seems uh, we can only pray for the soul of these, uh, you know, man known as as Fist Aguru. Uh, he died at the age of 47. Uh, the news is already filtering through uh, as we speak right now, and then we're going to go straight. Uh, like I said, he was born in Lagos State in 1975, December 13. He was measured as 7 feet 4 inch in height and is the second tallest human in West Africa as he died during a battle with what we called Akrumagali, known commonly as Gigantism. He died on Wednesday night on the 14th at the Lagos University Teaching Hospital Loot after he developed some complications. Recall that the 48 years old Aguru called for 5 million Naira health for medical surgery and therapy just a few months ago. Again, part of what we say in Nigeria, I mean, Nigeria not happen to you. You would expect such an individual not to even come in on the social media to ask for 5 million Naira when some of the politicians are stocking up the dollar. So we move straight now to the dollarization that we are just discussing as we speak right now. Once again, may the soul of a phase a piece. Currency floating, the private sector economics back the central bank as the Naira fall to 674 Naira to a dollar. The central bank of Nigeria yesterday has now directed deposit money bank to remove the red cap on the Naira at the official investor and exporter window of the foreign exchange. So many Nigerians, we talked about this a little bit yesterday, so many Nigerians do not understand how this works, you know. We've always have the banks where you can go in and say, I need um, $3,000 to send to my son in any part of the world. And that would literally mean that you need to be able to exchange that with the bank rate. But the bank have always sent you to the black market. Whether Tinobu is going to be able to curb the, the black market, we don't know yet. But this came barely two weeks after President Tinobu promised to unify the nation's multiple exchange rate and less than a week before the suspension and detention of CBN Governor Godwin Emefili, whose unorthodox monetary policy had become a stumbling block to the investor and the economy. Star Radio UK, I'll come again back to you in the studio. Wow, wow. That's quite an interesting one. But um, again... Uh, how that is going to impact citizens of Nigeria and uh, those in the business um, as to whether it's going to help them or not is another thing that we have to be watching closely. But Tunubu seems to be, I mean, uh, surprising people with all his actions that he's taking. I really hope that his decisions or whatever he's making will better Nigeria's life. Okay? Uh, Bishop Adeshin, I thank you very much. Yeah, he also fed us with information that uh, Aviz Agoro was seven foot or seven feet four inches tall. Um, may his soul rest in perfect peace, as we have said there. Well, it is already UK okay, in the North London studios. Mr. Olamiko, come here in the South Studios, Archie. Now, let's come to um, one other big thing that happened before um, the former president left the scene. Abu Hari, uh, that is the launching of the Nigeria Air Waste. Okay, now we've, we've heard all that has gone on, and now one other person, Onyema. I don't know who Onyema really is, but Yomi will be telling the, us. Uh, Oyema is the leader of the um, uh, is the owner of the Air Peace. Oh, Oyema. Air Peace Airline, yeah, 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 yeah. Okay, 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 Onyema, and then he's saying that. Tinubu should dissolve Nigeria Airways. Is he saying that because he thinks that that is some, something that is going to, I mean, compete with him, with whatever he is doing, because he's in the same aviation industry, and therefore, anything that maybe we can get more money or, or 
competition will be too keen and that will not better his life. That's what he's saying. That. But what has Oyama said? Well, when we look back again at these, uh, you know, Nigerian air, it has always been a question mark, even though the former minister is also speaking and disagree with the, you know, with the allegation and the rumor outside. But the Nigerian owner of airpiece, Oyeme, has now asked Bola Tinobu, the president, to dissolve the Nigerian air. What could be the reason? The chief executive officer of the airpiece, Alan Oyeme, has called for the dissolution of the Nigerian Air, the national carrier unveiled during the previous administration. This is suggested that the country should rather invest in a flag bearer airline than a national carrier, which he described as a moribund. Oyama spoke yesterday in the, uh, in the mainstream media in the morning yesterday, criticized the shareholding structure of the airline saying that it favors Ethiopia, he argued that Nigeria is contributing financial investment for the airline, while Ethiopia is said to earn 49% of the venture without actually putting any money into it. According to the federal government, took delivery of the first plane of the country national carrier Nigerian Air amid protests from local airline operator that it was contrary to a court order which barred the government from taking further action on the project. The airpiece boss revealed that in 2019, Ethiopian airline approached airpiece for a partnership, but he turned down the offer because of his patriotism for Nigeria, having that according to the agreement signed for the sake for the stake in Nigerian air, Ethiopians were not expected to bring in any money as an investment into the project. Also, he alleged that the leadership of the entire management of the proposed Nigerian Air, the DFO, CEO, and all the management positions were to be added by Ethiopians while the deputy position was given to Nigeria. Wow. So what is the connection between the Ethiopian Airlines and the uh, Nigeria, the um, alleged uh, air, airlines, the national airlines? That is, I, 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 is, is uh, Ethiopian Airlines going to be running the administration for them or managing the airlines? Is that what they're trying to do? Or are they going to be I mean, renting planes from them? What, what exactly is the negotiation that has gone on there? Well, I mean, the, the, these are the problems, you know. I mean, if looking at what he's saying there, you know, since 2019, this has been going on. I remember they came to London until we now have information that Ethiopia Airlines is actually, I mean, I don't know what airline they were going to be using in London anyway, so, but now that we find more a little bit information it seems that the whole project would not favor nigeria because if ethiopia is not putting any money down they're going to be the lead of the management position while nigerians will be the deputy it could be maybe because those planes will be leased to nigeria and that is more than enough as a stakeholder than putting in any monetary power but you know according to on says uh Ethiopia. He argued that Nigeria is contributing the financial investment for the airline, while Ethiopia is set to earn 49% of the venture without actually putting any money down. So it seems that that is contrary to a court proceeding that is already going on. Oyeme also stressed that the unveiling of the Nigerian air, despite the litigation, was a total disrespect of judiciary. The Nigerian government, especially the former president, Muhammadu Buhari, has never respected any judiciary because Inam Vikanu was kidnapped, renditioned, and Buhari thought is a normal thing to do in 21st century. He left the whole thing now for Bola Tinubu to deal with. And we did ask the question yesterday Will Bola Tinubu look into the case of Inam Vikanu from the judicial aspect? Or maybe we have to wait for a new AGF because the former one might also be arrested. We don't know yet, but it seems that Tinubu is taking it step by step. Well, the old man taking step by step. Well, 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 well. Uh, Anton and Deji, good morning to you. Uh, before I go to Adeban just Sunday. Now, the ownership structure of the Nigerian Airways uh, Air consists of Ethiopia Airlines as a majority shareholder with a 49% stake. Now, while Nigerian entrepreneurs and companies, namely MRS, uh, SA, uh, SACO, and the Nigerian Sovereign Fund, hold a 46% stake. 
the remaining five percent stake is held by the Nigerian federal government. So a bit of information there for you. So if we were thinking that Nigeria is going to own its own airlines, that was what was going to happen. It's a GPI airline just doing some business in Nigeria. But uh, yesterday we had a uh, Phoenix on the show and he was talking about how the Ethiopian airlines have managed their airline and up to now they are while well, even during the lockdown and everything whilst um, airlines were seeing a downtrend in their revenue they were still seeing an, an uptrend i mean making profit there so uh maybe it isn't that well they are the best people to maybe manage it and uh, maybe we get something out of it but whatever it is as we're saying majority of the funds is coming from nigeria so why shouldn't they rather get the bigger stake in it it is star ready just saying they say nigeria is finished since 1960 no more love from beginning in nigeria between igbos Hawuzas, Yorubas, united nations to end nigeria to save life now we are not one in nigeria hundred percent that's what he's saying so i'm coming away from star ready uk it is your favorite african and caribbean radio station in london bishop edition also says but my question is simply this is ethiopia if ethiopia can build plans what happens to nigeria to buy and run its service instead of renting planes <laughs> that is quite a big one there but let's see what happens let's see what happens okay let's move on to some of the other stories making the rounds now there are some people who are complaining uh that the um the um the D dss okay that's the anti-graft Agency said Nigeria government using anti graft agency that's the EFCC for political vendetta says Transparency International, and that is quite a, a serious one because Transparency International are the ones who will see whether people are being abused and all stuff, all stuff that is going on. But it looks like okay, if you are not in part uh, APC and you belong to PDP, then I can use the EFCC to somebody say pursue you and then maybe destroy whatever things that you are doing. So is that what the uh, Transparency International is saying? And is there any truth in that at all, Yomi? Well, you're quite right. Uh, you know, uh, when the, the world looks into Nigeria, especially the international community, they look at it from, you know, how the government manages some of the bodies that is meant to be part of the uh, system. Uh, yesterday, we looked into the NDIC and uh, some of what... Uh, was being revealed by the NDIC yesterday also indicate uh, what we have been saying when it comes to the the crime against corruption. And let me just give you a bit of the snip from what the NDIC chairman, which is the Nigeria, the the, uh, the new chairman of the Nigerian Deposit and Insurance Corporation. Abdullah Kim Abdul Latif, when the Independent or Transparency International looked at some of these, this end up to the same thing we are discussing here. Let's say a little bit from here. Nigerians, I will speak. Even if today is the last day I will spend in this world, I want you to know that the battle Ashwaju is fighting to rid this country of endemic corruption is the battle that cannot be left in his hand alone. Every head of parastatas in Nigeria must stand up to let him know the rot in your own establishment. I tell you, NDIC stinks. There's a lot of rot going on. They say when you fight corruption, corruption fights you. Now the document you see in my hand is one of the ways the corruption engineers in Nigeria are fighting back. You know, each time you say you want to have a true change, like the one brought about by President Ashwat Bola Medjinubu, you will have the change champions who will support him, but you have the change skeptics and the game, change, game changers who will frustrate all his effort to rid Nigeria of this mess. Now, this is the purported new act of the NDIC. And I tell you for nothing, this is a Mephidis act. I tell you because here they have taken away the powers of Mr. President in respect of the NDIC. Let me start by telling you the mandate of the NDIC. The NDIC is set up as an independent agency of government to ensure that the depositors' money is protected in all the banks and all financial institutions to protect it so that Nigerians 
can be protected from the misbehavior of bank directors, whether in conspiracy with the CBN or when they are acting alone. That is why the NDIC has been set up as an independent body to ensure that depositors do not cry even when banks fail. Well, we hope that nobody will cry because uh, what the transparency is saying is that it seems that the government are just using that against each other. The Transparency International in Nigeria says EFCC Chairman Abdul Rashid Bauer's suspension did not come as a surprise because the successful Nigerian government used the anti-corruption agency to settle political score. Obasanjo did the same thing. Are we going to see APC to APC? Because we know that Buhari was there for eight years, so that literally means that Tinubu will not be fighting PDP. He will probably be using the same thing to score between the same APC that he's probably not pleased with. Because I don't see him going after PDP that was not in power for eight years, or probably maybe the PDP that will probably disturb him. But most importantly, those that have been affected in the suspension and DSS coating at the moment are still one of those individuals that President Muhammad Buhari, the former president, put in there. But for now, the international transparency is saying that President Bola Tinubu is just doing the same thing that others have done, so nothing changed. But you can hear the cry of the new chairman of the NDIC saying that even if Tinubu wants to fight the corruption, corruption to the fight back, like the Nigerian will say. Hmm. Well, you fight corruption, corruption fights back. And what do we see and what can we do from there? Well, it is all coming away from Star Radio UK, your favorite African and Caribbean radio station in London. I bring it a time to 11.32 from the hearts of London. We'll go back to Yomi for some more of the stories making the rounds. Over to you, Yomi. We have so many Nigerian students that are studying outside Nigeria. And it seems that uh, even those that can afford it will probably have to find their own uh, dollar to be able to do so. The central bank has now removed exchange rate subsidy for overseas Nigerian students using Form A. Applications for medical, school fees, BTA, PTA, and the SME will continue to be processed through a deposit money bank. As part of its ongoing effort to harmonize the country exchange rate, the Central Bank of Nigeria has now discontinued providing forex subsidies to Nigerian students. The question Nigerians will be asking is, who are those benefiting from the forex subsidy? Because I myself will be thinking that, so that means Nigerians at some point have been enjoying even subsidy in the dollar, as some have enjoyed subsidy in the petrol. The APEC Bank has made this known in a statement saying that all the segmentation is being eliminated and that all segments are now to be collapsed under the investor and the exporter known as the IE windows. All segments are now collapsed to the investor and the exporter windows. Application for medical, school fees, PTA, PTA, SME will continue to be processed through a deposit money bank, the statement partly read. This operation changes mean that Nigerian schooling abroad paying for their school fees via the CBN rate will now have to pay the floated market rate. The question is, how many Nigerians are enjoying this subsidy that we are hearing today? Nigeria is just one country that you listen to, you read a lot of things, and the question keeps on going back and forth, just as the next headline is also coming again. Remember we talked about a senator asking the wife for favor from some of the court cases. Senator Bukatukwa admitted committing crime to be prosecuted, the Nigerian, the NBA. The statement was clearly admission by a senator that he attempted to and to or actually perverted the court of justice. Imagine in UK, asking the court of appeal judge to look into a case for you what would have been the current situation we've been monitoring uh, the former prime minister boris johnson that resigned he's been going through a lot of interrogation for the role that he played during the covid 19 but in nigeria everything just goes on the headline and everything fade away 
statement by the president of the Nigerian Bar Association, Mr. Yakubu Chonoko Mayakwa O-O-N, senior African of Nigeria, on the comment by the senator Adamu Mohamed Bukachukwa on the floor of the Senate on Monday, 12th of June. My attention has been drawn. Maybe he was not in the country because it's now almost 72 hours. But he said his attention has been done, has been drawn to a viral video clip on the social media of the comment made by a senator Adamu Bukachukwa on the floor of the Senate at the valedictory section of the Senate of the Ninth Assembly before it was interrupted and stopped by the then Senate President Ahmed Lawan. Senator Bukachukwa, in his remark, among other things, referred to confidential dealings he had had with some of his colleagues in the Senate and went to say, I look at faces in this chamber whom have come to me and sought for my help when my wife was the president of the Court of Appeal. I am sure in his concluding remark he said, and I must thank my I must thank particularly my wife, whose freedom and independence I encroach upon while she was in office, and she has been very tolerant, accepted by the encroachment, extended her help to my colleagues. This is what is happening in the Senate floor, where they are using their position to help each other. Wow, what a country for the rich and the country for the poor. Let's go straight to the social media where we discuss some of what is trending this morning. Once again, the question is, how is the Senate president and the president going to react to so many of those things that is still happening in Nigeria at 37 minutes past 11? Central Bank is trending. I'm sure you know why. Buhari is trending. Why is Buhari still trending? Is the former president uh, uh, in a particular video that I came up uh, during the Niger Voices, this is what the former president actually told us. Don't try it. Even if you try it, you will be in problem. Let's listen to him. Nobody should ask me to come and give any evidence in any court. Otherwise, whoever it is, he will be in trouble. Well, you heard him very well. Maybe we'll play it one more time, and then I'll do a little bit voiceover. Nobody should ask me to come and give any evidence in any court. Otherwise, whoever it is, he will be in trouble. Nobody should ever ask him to come and give any evidence in the court of law. Otherwise, if you try it, you will be in trouble. Wow. Well, why is it trending? EFCC has now summoned the ex-evasion minister, Seriki, question Nigerian air official, the minister at the Twite of Buhari administration, launch Nigerian air. So it seems that the DSS have now called the former evasion minister. That is the breaking news that is coming through as we speak right now. EFCC summoned ex-evasion minister Seriki, question Nigerian air official. Seriki Farouk, Seriki Malami should be the next in custody of the DSS. Just to understand what the hell happened in the last eight years. This is coming from Maurice Moyer as we are now looking into some of the headlines from the social media. David Odoye, Nuru Buhari from EFCC Cybercrime Division is being taped as his replacement. Reward his favor to Minister Bola Tinubu. So it seems that Nuru Buhari is coming up. We don't know yet. We have to wait and see. So Buhari is trending. Shehu Ghazali Sadiq at Shehu Oscar and in northern Nigeria complaining of marginalization with regard to Tinubu's recent political appointment is stupid. Buhari ran the most nepotistic, nepotistic government in the history of Nigeria. You kept quiet because he's your own. Those of us that criticize him were all insulted. And let's go for a little bit more. He went on to say again, Cost daily as enemies. I remember making a post sometimes ago, warning that table will turn one day. I hope you will all maintain your quiet now that the table has turned. Please maintain your quiet disposition and let Bobo Chicago enjoy his government like Buari did moreover. Those of us in the obedient movement warned the North about Tinobu, but nobody listened. We beg that you give Peter B a chance to the right wrongs in our polity, but you call us IPOB. You read the election for Tinobu. Please enjoy him, Joe. 
So it seems that uh, this individual, you know, is a full-blown obedient, telling those that are now complaining that Tinobu is becoming a little bit to the side of the Yoruba, but that seems us in, in the favor of some other as well. Afiz Agoro is already trending. We talked about him. He's so rest in peace. I'm not sure why Home Office is trending in Nigeria, but as you know, we have a lot of Nigerians that are studying in the UK. Maybe it has something to do with Nigeria. I am not too sure, but maybe, maybe, we don't know. There's no evidence yet, but um, the Home Office wants you to live in chaos while they oversee your replacement. Uh, we don't know what has happened yet, but what we can say is that the man that committed the crime yesterday or day before yesterday in Nottingham is from West Africa. We are not too sure the real breakdown of which part of West Africa. Maybe that is what that is trending. I don't know. But I've looked at why Home Office is trending under Nigeria this morning. I can't say anything, but a 23-year-old is a refugee from Sudan who was granted a final leave to remain in Britain last year by the Home Office. Despite the fact that he was already facing this rape charge, it is always innocent citizens who pay for the failing. So nothing to link Nigeria, but we have to wait and see. So let's take one more from the social media, then I'm going to come back again to you. Service chief is trending. Maybe there will be the line that Tinubu will be removing. Time will tell. Star Radio UK, this, the finest African and Caribbean radio station, Dr. Elmo, PSYD, under at Dr. Elemo Atiku. Suspension of the CBN governor is not an achievement. Suspension of the EFCC chairman is not an achievement. Appointment of the SGF and COS is not an achievement. Sacking the service chief is not an achievement. Appointing new minister is not an achievement. Every new government since 1960 does the same generic act to build its own team. There's nothing new about this. This engagement appointees of the previous government and the foolishness and the stupidity now. And that is coming from someone definitely in support of Atiku. Wow, wow, that's a lengthy one there. But listen, let's start with the UK, your favorite African and Caribbean radio station in London. I bring it the time now to what? 18 minutes to the top of the hour. But let me read some of the comments that have come true. Uh, Bishop Adeshina says, uh, but UFCC were supposed to be independent. Well, you know what? When it comes to Africa, uh, institutions that are supposed to be independent are not actually independent. They get on doing all sorts. So that seems to be one of the things that is happening. Adejoke uh, Olaniyi says that, may God bless you, Koiki, and Omabala G. Abdullah, he says, Atuno Misrachi and uh, Mr. Koiki Almighty Allah bless every one of your team. God bless Star Radio UK. God bless you too there. And lots of love to you. And say, Yoruba Nation, Yoruba Nation, no going back. Now, you know I mean? It's quite interesting, all those um, comments and, and things that people are putting across there. And I, I really hope, I really, honestly, I want to give um, um, Tunubu a bit of chance. I mean, because of the thing that he's doing, people thought that maybe he just coming to, just going to come in and they just do same old, same old. But he seems to be having a mind of his own, trying to make his own, I mean, uh, what, impact on Nigeria. So let's see. But have we, as of yet, had anything pertaining to Chief Sunday Boho? And uh, in Amdikano, we did talk about that, uh, you know, yesterday. And, uh, you know, we have few supporters of Bola Tinubu with us through our Niger voices yesterday, you know. And like we always say, we make sure we balance the conversation, you know, without being biased. You know, some of them believe that with time, Tinubu will give Sunday Bowo the freedom that he's been asking for to return back to Nigeria without any, you know, uh, 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 problem with the Nigerian government, as we know from what. Uh, Buhari did with him. Also, you know, we talked about Inam Dekano, especially knowing fully well that Buhari kidnapped. You know, there's nothing, you know, in the international law today that allows such rendition and kidnap. Even Abba Kiari is still in Nigeria with the request of the DSS. So what we can say is that with time, uh, Tinobu will have to prove himself, especially with these two individuals. But some are asking Buari, uh, you know, wanted to, you know, pick up uh, 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 Dr. Sunday Buhu, but that didn't happen because Bene Republic put their foot on the ground to say that we will not give Buari the opportunity to remove Igbo from Bene Republic. Would Tinubu do it in a reverse way? 
by giving him that access to move around, knowing fully well that the reason why Igbo was kept in Benin Republic is for the fact that Buhari, under the DMDSS, put a note out that it must be stopped at any airport in any part of the world. And that was the reason why Benin Republic actually stopped him. But now, some are saying that Igbo hasn't committed any crime in terms of those that are asking and begging Bola Tinobu. Tinobu also had the opportunity to flee for his life when Abacha wanted to eliminate him. Whether he went by road, whether he went by car, whether he went by ship, but we know that he spent more time in UK until Abacha died and returned back home. I'm not sure anybody begged uh, you know, for the return of Tinobu, but what Igbo is fighting for is the right to self-determination under the international law, which Bola Tinobu needs to negotiate with Professor Banji Akintoye and the Biafra so that we can have a peaceful exit out of Nigeria for those that are agitating. Well, listeners, that's been quite, I want to call it a mouthful or a handful of information that has come to you today. But we're going to be running up uh, the updates from Nigeria. And um, as we you know, as I've been saying, let's keep fingers crossed. We don't know. The new president doing all sorts. Who knows? Who knows? Who knows? Yeah, maybe we wake up one day and then one morning and they say, well, you know what? We, we just freedom for everybody and everybody can get on with their lives in peace and maybe the marginalization will all cease and we'll see something different from night for nigeria as a whole but on that note let me say thank you very much yomi uh your last words before you leave us well it is not uh, any other platform it is a star radio uk network stay tuned with us there's still more news traffic coming up to you but for now uh, as i always say uh, you are in the good hand of Ache to take you through the rest of the program. But later on tonight is the property hour. Even if you're not buying yet, listen, you might be buying in the near future. My name is Alami Koike on the Star Radio UK Network. Thank you so much. I'm biting now. Bye-bye. Well, listen, that has been Mr. Alami Koike bringing you updates from Nigeria. It comes your way every weekday from 11 o'clock during the course of the morning show. But for now, we're going to take in some musical break and once we come back... Thank you so much, uh, you know, uh, so far, uh, let me just say we are now going to go into our own discussion. We can't have a lot of we've adjusted all the audios and everything that needs to be adjusted. Uh, we are just finishing so much kind of movement because uh, I have to keep moving those on the Instagram. Uh, we have to keep moving the bias, you know, uh, is a... It's a mobile studio that looks. Hey, I'm not really. Uh, I now have to keep moving those on the Instagram. Uh, we have to keep moving. Mobile device, uh, mobile studio. You know me, so that literally means that every now and then, thank you so much, uh, my apology. I have to keep moving things around. So uh, let me um, bring you out here first. Let's get my face into the camera. But as usual, uh will do a little one to a T. I don't shake in here. Oh, well, I don't shake you. Uh, it doesn't matter whether you are in uh, any part of the world. But well, I don't shake it to Star Radio UK. Uh, we love you all, especially in Taiwan and Nigeria. I always say, uh, looking at my record all the time, you guys are spending a lot of money. So let me remove the Star Radio UK there and bring my face in. Uh, I might just stand up for 10 minutes or so, but before then, Let's get my face in. Yeah, I love this background though. You know, I use OBS to stream so they can joke about that. That, that. Uh, I know it's showing me red, so called stable. So I don't know why. So bear with us. Uh, it shouldn't be like that, but uh, not too sure why it's not stable. Uh, oh, I can see that the broadcast is not stable. What I'm going to do, I know I'm running some few things at the background. Uh, maybe that is what is training the broadcast this morning. So let me shut down some of the... Because every time we're loading, we're uploading, 
so and also osonlawa so it's a busy this is a peak time latiwa and we prove latiwa on air hopefully uh you know in the future i'll be able to upgrade again but uh, we have to be sure because there's different price for different internet so only only gets is something much better but for now it's more manage it's okay uh if we think that we should increase it at the appropriate time i will do so so what for jimati osha let me let it change me that is sound and the sound they say we love america eh? Then in my last lossy, I don't print lati shebi. Cause Ojoti Pile is so loja kuma umu shifi man the low star radio. Cause ko ko a presentable mo. So yan mushin the money uh it's killing your sure. Uh huh. Uh in a low lady, in a low lady, and then you ask me. Muki well and conceal. The like is suits me. Eh, she mumu. She mumu baby. <laughs> she mumu baby. Then no dollar she yawo. Hmm. Moke owe. Eba kwa some mummy wa ati yani mire a mufita wata mufiki. Salam alaikum na laja Fatima. Salam kile wabu. She mumu baby. Hmm. Moke owe. Eja nke owe te mira da. Eja nke moke la ro. Eh mummy wa Chrissy. Oh, he's still catching up with this morning program. Ah, that's why behind me. I'm going to America. I'm going to see you. It's 7 o'clock. You see, depending on the time zone. 1, 2, 3, 4, 5. Yeah, I'm going to see 7. I'm going to see 6. I'm going to see 5. America is not in a different time zone. So, you know, I'm going to see you. So, I'm going to see you in the morning lecture. 1 hour 30 minutes. I'm going to see you in the morning lecture. Since I'm going to see you in another program. So maximum one hour thirty minutes, lama mache, so that early my catch up with the programs here. So you know, at least we keep you guys. No, we keep you our. You know, we keep you all busy, which I'm sure you like anyway. Because I've heard my lot boy anything to my mind divert mind, especially our time proper program. I want to put on a proper program. Even I want to disagree with you, but you don't take for the content. Ah, the Federal by Yoruba Nation could possible. Walai. Could see be say this up with more fair Yoruba Nation. Ah, the Federal by. And then move to Kini so many Uti wa to far away. Could see by say fair now fair Yoruba Nation. Kawa na be Federal by. Eh. Could work. So could work. Eh, you know that. But about them Federal we have Federal Yoruba Nation there. At the soil Yoruba Nation in Kamilie. Ah, the Federal by Yoruba Nation. Ah, the Federal by. No, and to have a fear of your banishment, then is a is a waste of time. A castle in Bomi, Yemi, Fatu Kerbali, in me. Okay, you want a six sixty five bed, Musa Bed, money just before seven o'clock because America wa one, two, three, four, five, five hours behind, but I want state to come eight hours behind. I want to wa in Japan, he let you show other team, Australia, New Zealand, so different time zone. The one you go and buy it. So, you know, again, couple of kids in Tiwa Dada, we go in Parapata. Mokimi Baba Wa Ibrahim, she too. Hello to one bed. Again, more another phone one because sometimes I want your one in a program. Thank you, Lee. I have quite you that the old Kimi Kilo Day Umba Mijani. No, 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 no. I have a good job. So I can keep it under. Again, Mokima Matubi Milo Mamureki Uba Mujuru Ba World Media. Mokia Luka. Mokia OBJ. Mokia Wa. Obasanjo, Mokia Gbomi Jakulu Shola, congratulations, Mushari Facebook, let me see. Mutuki Akono, congratulations, hmm, Tibatini, congratulations, Oti, Oti, Dungu, America, but I'm not going to mention their name, Eshe Goni, they shared the joy with me yesterday, congratulations again, and Mutuki Akono, I need to come, think on to unfet over the bossy, you know, it's a, it's a good excitement. Go easy. Go to America. Go to my wife. Who might tell you what I'm going to do? As you go to the school, you have to go to the school. 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 You have
Bubu ano la magba iwe yen. O koma ni time different ni. So yon kon celebrate pe lo mi la nan pe oti do hon. Oti do be. O ye yin ti ba zok oti do be. Oti do be. Pon la amerika. Iwe yen. Alay. O koma ni time. Oti do be. Pon ni amerika. Bo ki mega money. If it is if it is in a same society, some individuals should have been in prison by now. A lie. Banana Republic in Nigeria, a baro. Moke Ajani Ajala. Shegu Yovo Moke Olani Pekuma Bilu Tiku no tiku ni titi titi o get me. Oh la be a med at the Allah Moki. So eh? A lie. And do what ba Mali America. You don't do them a fit in Nigeria she. A jar egg bomb if I don't care. Broadcast and woman on 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 fluctuate at the so at the domino team fluctuate on the common law in and out. So maybe I should stop and continue upload that can disconnect me for now because Kenya and Pekoto ah so more go life la la so people more click life no no they go life no relay no to bye bye eh only brother me continue by manage the page. I want to look at Yoruba Nation and Foja. But life, more clip, more broadly life, like over 40 minutes. It's okay. Work on this board to start with your name. So, you yeah, can, you need not to say 43, you need to upload the time. Anyway. So, you need cut down and continue to upload so that you can find any without any disruption. You need to have an Ethernet cable. Wi-Fi on Shinto da lati ma fi broadcast. So we ki ma lo ethernet cable but location bi shen joko every day. E mo mi to ni ages. E ku to ju me se gbon ni. Mo ki baba wa adegbola ola de meji. Eh la to domini network yen mo ti cut it down so my stable is still the green pattern you see at the domini mo upload ni. Video mo ta bi pe mi ma gbo video mi mo fi sell to social media. Ma ma se wa la to pe ma gbe video ma je ko gbo gbo video mi lo. What is stable is separate as only you two. What is stable is you two are the green you see. So multi multi break it, multi more upload it, multi close it. Multi -close it. Mama shit, my party program. Em a car or mummy wa olaji de coca. Muki sister me no olaji re. Muki bubu e yi e nyawa. Kaki bubu agba yi. Ama soro ni pa topic mo fe soro le lori but. The commission kon lawa lawa ba. Tini kon mo mula pa ron. A go meji la de tini. Wede ni tini la fin shi tita. Owo la bi aziz mo ma ke. So. So mo wo. Ba wo la jifi bere. Mo wo video kanti mo le play fun wa ti. Ok bi a kak bo. Check a play. A rot smith yen. Koko o tu je reminder. Yo bi a ba 20 minute. Bo mo le malo to 20 minute. Kito pa da wa so le desk ni. But I think of you, one of kitchen, in the old team, the game, the In the washing program, for you are. Hey, my Jack for care, my king, grandma, mommy, me Felicia, I got the monkey. So I call you back, I find you don't cast. I got from a silly, you didn't follow the resources. I want your mother to be a foreigner. I'm a negotiator, but you know who I was topic and other topic, my face on the lorry. I think it's a topic of one. It's more cost it topic, it's a roy, money. Professor Adebanji Akintoye Oraku, YSDM would continue to ask federal government of Tinobu to discuss the way out. Ah, my brother, 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 Mo boyin na ni o dada. Mo boyin barapata. Mo ki baba wa Steve. Loge, lo loge. Video on circulate. I'm not sure whether ti e mi feel ni so too many fake and you know tony ton show wo kan kan. Mo ki yawa Miss David. Yawa gbe mi leke mo ma ki. Mo ki gbo eyan olulufe platform wa. So, it have been discussed during the negotiation. Mr. Yemi Matthew Bukola, 
a o ko biri ni ma je na kola okun ni na ma je kola yoruba lo ruko to dasha a ma je e ma wori ni pawo to ba n gbe ba wa ko lo ba won e ba won to dawo sodo won ni e ma wori gbogbo pawon yete ma mention mo won bo wodori platform mo ba to je ko cha a wa ko la cha do wo awon to dawo mo ton dawo fun na so e ya ko ma da to si ma ta e ya ko ma da si be ko ma ta Eh, hey, they were exposed on the program last night. Iranio, I have been with a message that money they have been collecting money from people into their own personal account. Money meant for the struggle. One who exposed one, I jamma deni yano. So I call it on the like room kanda yano. Oh my God, the phone is dead. One who go on the platform one to I come alone in the struggle. Okay. I mean, I might be me just order the land now. Mo wo program to the land now. I know I mo be only titi mo atro the land now. It's be going on salary. We say to worry by because only thing was go that but to the twenty minutes to six. Ah, money che money what did the full star radio? Why I don't know much. I know Mike. Only one hour ni musu. Eh, but when you allow the image, you know, so we over serious gun. I'm going to go to the next one. Ghana is going to go Ghana flag. I'm going to go to Kutonu, Cote d'Ivoire, Togo. I'm going to African countries. I'm going to go to the Kenya. I'm going to go to the Kenya. It's South Africa. It's a very program. I'm going to go to no, I eh, can play video here so that I can coffee the day. Kilo one hundred. At least, mama, the video in my last twenty minutes. Eh, hey, mommy, wa ye ye olu toyosi abolu wa eshegoni adura gugwa magba. Mama, very happy life. Both as of me, mama, we need fair to go. Alone, need fair, you know. Alone, let need fair go. She mean everywhere in Africa, worldwide. <laughs> Moki oba oba obele gushi. Eh, we saw ni ba Yoruba nation ni kilo shele kabiesi. Interesting. Tinu puma ma shetan. Oba ti shetan yaba ikile ma shepe la omala. Eh? Eja ya tete ya ya kan negotiate. Ki bo guaka wa do ju kan. Bo guana la jama wa nu country yen na. Ah, kilo wa le toy. Eh, bo guala jama wa nu nengi ni nu Yoruba nation ni peli nengi le ane ni le oshi. Nigeria call Nigeria. Oh, the stable is here. Oh, to one full green. So YouTube the stable, we go to stable. Talo pe ko, talo pe beni rule to wa le yimi ni Kwara State. Talo ma koko ba ko rule ni Kwara State. Comment si kong bo to ni. Hey, mommy, me marry him ni madness group of people. We love you and it go oh sha beni. Mommy, mama to da. You know, post comment on this thing more. Then, when comment and you are because sometimes comment in my wallet, more comment on this thing. No, let me comment on that. Show you to go to that day. More comment. Oh, more you mommy, my mother, dad, toy, dad, 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 she buy, my sorrow buy. More than boss, he learn. Oh, more than me now. But cause if I finish a program, I will come. Every I will be share better program. Lah, boy. Oh, more they come to what to what that day. Ah, you know man, share you better than me, you know. There will always be somebody to mash out what they dag guru. Comment to come bomb, but more they comment here. Oh, I'm glad to record you to do one. Again, let's check it. Comment to come bomb, learn come. Okay, again, she buy. A little bit of a comment here. Eh? At the program, you day one hour, 30 minutes or so. What do you want to do? You want to do one hour, you want to do one hour. You want to do one hour. Eh? You want to do one hour. 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 Good, good, good afternoon. A cog of media. <laughs> Ah, you only no volume. We are not bad. Yeah, and she switch over. Volume, wow, no volume. Okay. 
So, eh, I can go play Kokon, then Kiwa Padawa, eh, Kukon Pes on the program, eh, if you damn it, listen to me, Kima Solo. Baba, I love you, Koiki, for your good job. Nigeria is all Nepal country. <laughs> so, all right, eh, I can go, eh, I can play, just a reminder. Eh, I can go play, Baba, Kito, eh, no. Picture the day. I can go play UNPO one, yeah. Power move further. Talorati only then go they post, then go they then get then get oh la till then go they post. Wait till you get, you no get nothing. Talorati only eh, erotic sister why? Hey, I can show you to daddy. Oh yeah. Toru Japan here. Twenty-four years old. What pattern? Ah, I share with him a lot. Why? That be a silly rumari. Never mind. We change to. I want to. I want to. I want to go this thing. Oh, mama, so we are only. What's your name? Mas to wa lori e calculator ni o padanu Nigeria To lu la paro ti le niyan o te ba mo Ah oni sister wa kan omo ko gini won same part of ko gini awon ti wa iku be gbe o dun won gan Olorun ba nro ti gbogbo yin e ya ra ko gist won se ya ko gi o gbogbo gbogbo di o ya mo ya ko gi lana ni o e mo pe mi o ni time mu gba nkan be awon mo luka gbogbo won ko ba ma di pelu o be awon mo ya ko gi na di phone sile ah awon mo ma ma si to wa lori e calculator ni o pada nu 24 years old tina jira ba le pa yan bayi and it took Jack in Ron and Jiria, talk about it. Oh, who sent in and you know, one in a five, a little artist, I call it one of the co je so I call it my daddy, but I put you there, oh my bassy food, you there, but there, what's your belly? Baba, all I be, oh, my dad, what enjoy? Mass to my Lurie, for that mass to my Lurie, because at my dip electronics on the bottom of mass. Electronics like this, Sherry. Come on, join in. Come back. Come on, blow. What one you worry fast? Worry fast. Not to reverse. Not to reverse. What part? If if you money, you go give. If you money, you only take money. Money, money. You only take. Eh, Baba, Baba, you take no money. You only take. You go give. You take shop. You are a customer. You are a customer. Bus or on the be around April. Voilà, il faut tout payer pour vous connaître un peu plus en ce cas de cas. Eh, 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 Number me lo wa loke yen, e wa ba mi so reason ti mo gbodo ri nkan to da ninu Nigeria. Mo be yin mi o, e ma pe prince e ma pe mo ba yin ja. Prince Alawo Abdulakim e ja fi ati ninu nkan to ti ta se wa ni biba. Eni Mr. Man, mo se Mr. Man, ola yo mi ko ikini ni je ko ikini dia. So next time e respect mi dada. Eni Mr. Koiki, owo ni Mr. Man. Ngba ta se ta se a mo lata mo ni ko. Eni why don't you say anything good in Nigeria? And then you know, profile leader that lay you know, you know, Prince Killer Pulani, but I'm a pound to buy your prince or my bunny. So, like, but along, or I get a job out, you let you rumor the battle. I job at all, key politician man, no, he let back, come and determine me or buy me. Tell about what I'm about anything. I be a politician, no, what? See, or Baba Fed travel, you see, I lost a full politician. I be. So the Emi was in Nigeria, but the more our palace that they take us in, so if we return, be me here. Emi was on being this thing. Okay, we turn it out and this thing. Okay. Lagos lewa, we do perform long. She she business in the if it's a grocery line here. Bongari Petrosi. 
o na pe abe travel lele mo wo picture yin bayo wow any good business allah fa lo barika si you are all you always say any suru ile so na enisi any you always say positive things about nigeria ni boni positive na wa ni boni positive na wa prince eh se ba mi pe so the program ka jo yan ju e allah ba wa pelu yin e ma ka abara wa ja ibere ni mo de like awon suit te wo yi ata wa go te fi so wo ni january 2022 mo mo bi te ti a picture e jare side bi ti awon se she GT, she me put GT. Loman turns round about the shape. You know, till your picture in there. All I'm about to do is, Cherry, eh, like Nigeria to me. I see the most of you here. Can most of you Prince? Eh, fair on Nigeria to me. Eh, till very low. I'm going to kill you today. I'm going to be. No, 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 no. I'm not going to let my fool down. I'm going to let my fool down. It's only. It is my job. I'm going to be. Twenty fifteen. I'm going to be in Nigeria. Project mo fe in Nigeria. Ma ti beat the project en she lawo lawo. Owo ti mo ti run sinu Nigeria as a person. Mo ro pe ti run owo be mo sorry gan. Okay, o da pe on travel ni bi bai. E man travel go abi. Very good. Now, ki lo pe ni Nigeria prince. Ki ni won pe ni Nigeria e je ka koko bere be. Ta ba ni Nigeria e je lo change the background we. E je gbe picture Nigeria wa. Because and so this is where Catherine on Nigeria, I be playing with Catherine on Nigeria. Now, my one being this in Prince Bay, can you ever can Catherine in Nigeria? And yet, for me, the answer is your con. We quite key in con your con. We have Catherine in Nigeria. Can you ever can Catherine in Nigeria? Any other piece of work? Any other thing in Nigeria? What for you? My man like a challenge. Shall we have? Any other thing? 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 Ele ni magbe sen yin debt e ma sa lo prince o e le doro le o e ma sa lo eh eh e je ka jo yan doro idada o as an intelligent man i want to say i want okay any as an intelligent man i want you to say good thing about nigeria e bo una ni mo bi pe e fun mi ni nkan to je yo kon ti ma fi so koro ni pa nigeria she security she economy it means up in Bay Momsi, Miss Akuro, Nigeria, in 1991. Anything so good about Nigeria? Dollar, then you finish a business. Got Moriko and Perman travel, Motilawo, background image. Boba Jacob Dubai, then law, Emara dollar, la Roy, any six hundred dollar. See, no, sorry, six hundred naira to a dollar. Nigeria produce you. Oh, Cherry Popo, Nigeria produce you, yeah, into British is of one year, and yet, yes, let me be Nigeria produce you. Ni born in Nigeria wa in 1913. Money kept me one lake at your sorrow. Can't bomb me. And in Nigeria produce you. Uh, so think about Nigeria to produce you. Ni born in Nigeria wa before 1914. Che montong pe ni amalgamation. Get it, body. Che montong pe ni amalgamation. And in Nigeria produce me. Et me one lake plus 44. I don't think I can call you see. Plus 44, 74. There is nothing called Nigeria. Okay, Prince Alawa Abdul Akim. Kosiko Otonje Nigeria. British or Britain. Lo provide the Uru Kote Ekin Pirayini Nigeria. There is nothing called Nigeria, okay? If it's Motiko Kote knocking out in here. Kosiko Otonje Kwe Nigeria produce anybody. Chama Kwa Parofu Wani Watawa in secondary school. One in River Niger was found by Mongopa. The person believe in you, that means pay. Hey, ti monti ko bu kanchi lo. So, moa ri ni simple. E yon mo yoruba te e wa ni le. E ni Nigeria lo produce mi. Our countries, our country that kosi ko kotonja our country. Baba ija re efe be. Ife ko boti nje lo. Kosi ko kotonja my country. Kilo nje my country. Che kila matong pe ni country. Any my country, our country is our country. Either good or single or two. Nigeria is not a country, please. Mole, mole, buy, mole, buy. Are you yebele? Nigeria is not a country. Kilo pe ni country. Kini wong pe ni country. Tell me wong pe ni country. You don't know what is called a country. So using people at that thing, narrative and visitor. Oh sure, we and you are okay. You know Nigeria, but intelligence in. Pe di pa pe an soro country e morara 
Iti yon ba dem mon. No, 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 no. Mon educate wani. Because ok bodo ok information yon lo sado yon lo mi. Ok bodo yon. Wani ki finisi le. But part of, ba afe educate wani yon. No, le le. Because, ala kou yon soro yon isi. Is. And to body want to was suit you anything, you're not going to be exposed. Eh, we're exposed. We're seeing a lot of gender in Nigeria as a country. It's a fraud. Nigeria was put together for the economic reason of Britain. Malo So there's nothing called Nigeria. So the word Nigeria shows that way. Eh, you put around in there, put around in your mouth, you're buying your prince here. Eh, the understanding of what Nigeria, what you want, grammar, do you want so using the word be you were produced by Nigeria. No, 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 no. Number one, Nigeria could not produce me. He had to be me at Ibaba me, not just soon to the be me. What be me sinu iluti British change identity. Don't go in Nigeria. Go see anywhere. Don't go in Nigeria. So I'm not gonna play. So video Aaron Smith lama play kilo fili one for the magic. Prince Emma Salo a joke okay go into Aaron Smith so. As many of you that were Nigeria, no talk when you going on a wonderful politics or anything, but understanding in about Nigeria, oh, look, and it's part of the history. To your kuro, there's a car of mommy or grandma, duper gola, or no adiola mokiba. So there's nothing called Nigeria, and I wish you would understand that. Mo baida, eriba budawa, but one thing I can say is, Prince Mo Benny. Emma's lost it. I guess okay. Yes, no. Talk. One project in Nigeria is a country, but this is like we see the country Nigeria. Nigeria is not a country, and that okay. Maybe I should start with this. And so, when Nigeria is a country, oh, Jonathan, da, eh, can come and play. Be a can come and boil it. Eh, boil it. No, no. Eh, they can play. Eh, lay. Prince Emma Salo. Eh, boil it. No. I will play. Lay. Tom, I play to Jonathan. So that tell them what we push. Please, how many companies did you have to help people in Nigeria before abuse the good country? There's nothing good about Nigeria. Baba, I can go go change change your logic. Oh, since we're good in Nigeria, and in Nigeria, the country, a bunch of tea, Georgia, can last on development. It's impediment to drug development. Without Nigeria, we would be where we are. Now, if two who are far ahead of South Korea and North Korea, who are far ahead of China, even we had television before France. We are doing the first South Africa. Now look at where we are today. I think it's a shame that even any Yoruba man can be talking about restructuring at this point in time. What are we restructuring? This, this, this country that is already shot to pieces? I don't think that's what we want. But they are always talking about giving Nigeria a chance. The person... Prince is giving Nigeria a chance. It shows that Mosori gone. Understanding it, money, money, going pay, it's only pay arira. To tabari ra no, sama bara wajani no. But understanding it, man, Nigeria, eh, understand it. Emma Paro, it take money pay. What people go ask in Nigeria? In Nigeria, Latin operate Latin 1960. But in Jemo, it will learn Nigeria. In Jemo, it will learn Nigeria. So, eh, you are making your biba, but the kid are the prince. Eh, you are Lara. I want to see as you pay. Look on what don't pay Nigeria. Because information to fool one here, but echo of the car go in tea, a boy is a deleton, how to play to Jonathan. Because of your brother, the Nigeria has come to an end. If you don't allow we be a man's book, that's the so logical republic of Nigeria will be a worse place. place. Than, than Somalia, Somalia. And, and today it is happening. And, and if you have not allowed for Somalia, Somalia these are these boy and so that's in Somalia, these are trying and doing so as quickly as possible because the zoo is on the path of destruction, and there is nothing man can do to reverse it. Mark today's death, and what I'm telling you, Nigeria will be destroyed beyond human comprehension. I'm thinking about. I'm not going to be a man being a good priest. Mama, well, eh, I want Ibo. Ibo, you know me. Eh, Ibo, no like him. What if they come on Ibo in love? Eh, sure, make sure they keep property that. Prince, they back what video Jonathan? They back to South Africa. Nigeria is a country. I just be to see what they move to South Africa. Just be understanding him. Nipa, in South Africa, Nigeria, kule kule eh kule yeyimo. Ene onisha ro biya pa lo conversation asoni biba. Answer the majority. 
Move video ye that my play ni see. One light a light not be light. Two minutes eighteen seconds ni. Move ke farabale ka jogbo. Ke wa comment ti pada. Ema ti comment ni see. No, I am about our Jibawan and Dia Gonset. I'm about the Doku Repetition. I'm about our Jan. I'm about she idiot people. Be on Shore Kori Bay. You show a Kori Bay or Timber Ronda. A Farabale can go be by Prince. Two minutes eighteen seconds. Me video. Teba Botton. A war expressy. Kin understanding me because Chama with Jonathan of a sorrow. You see, Jonathan is a former president. Oshilo Kitinobu. Bugwala Moye. A parabale, a job, two minutes. More than interrupt. Taba Taba to our bottom, move a comment page or a Dominic at the wallet, the wallet, be a den beruni, a little bit of number below a looking at plus forty point. But a jack out bonti Jonathan so came in denominator. How we've been having this conversation about the unity of Nigeria. And I reflect back at some of the prominent statements made by some of our founding leaders. And I feel that probably this will help us to have a conversation on the Nigerian unity. I just brought four, not to bore you. First, and I'm quote, and I quote, not my statement, Nigeria is not a nation. It's a mere geographical expression. There are no Nigerians in the same sense as there are English, Welsh, or French. The word, the word Nigerian is merely a distinctive appellation to distinguish those who live within the boundaries of Nigeria from those who do not. This is accredited to Chief Obafemi Awolowo, the former Prime Minister of the Western Region. The second one, and I quote, it is true that we politicians always delight in talking loosely about the unity of Nigeria. Sixty years ago, there was no country called Nigeria. What is now Nigeria consisted of several large and small communities, all of which were different in their outlooks and beliefs. The advent of the British and that of Western education has not materially altered the situation. And the, men, and the many and varied communities have not knit themselves into a composite unit. This is accredited to Sir Amado Bello, former Premier of Northern Region. They thought, and I quote, since 1914, the British government has been trying to make Nigeria into one country. But the Nigerian people themselves are historically different in their backgrounds, in their religious beliefs and customs and do not show themselves any sign of willingness to unite. The Nigerian unity is only a British intention for the country. country. Prince, kill a bonny bit, a borrow day, and she a bond understanding, see Jonathan Sonny Bensha. She can to she annual before a be a understanding. Oh, yes, I kill a you have a mother. I don't care anybody, only God. Kill a tis on this, it's a two so long, eh? Into man sumi kwe la wun yon ye. Ki la ti so nisi, te tun boro lon jade nisi. Ki la ti so nisi. Eh, ni la ti boro. Eh, to ba, abe yon tun boro du poni tiri ni. Eh, uche jekwe ta ba tin soro ke 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 ba. Oro lon le makoko mati si waju. Eh, fyo lon si le. My dear brother, it is Nigerian spoil Nigeria. We will get the fault. Ah, na ba yon da koko mi. I'm gonna leave you alone. You are not getting the message. These are the stumbling block that we have at home. So, we will teach Jonathan Sonny Sin. In the end, we will say, Nigeria will spoil Nigeria. Yo! And you know what? Sherry Pay, all the fans are going to do more, we will stop. Sherry Pay, I will understand she, we will do more for your own. Sherry Pay, I need the platform to help you, I share it, and I will do more to buy it, you will do more to buy it, you will do more to buy it. I will teach you Sonny Sin. Prince is going to show Sonny Sin, my dear brother, yes, more than like a lawyer. Cherry pay, shall I yoruba? In the man loan, yeah. Cherry pay, in the babakito, you know, loan, yeah. My beloved brother, because brother, like a jet, but brother, why to understand, understand the way I can share Nigerians. What's in the kilo, John? Again, Prince, again, my again, play the last one. Uh, 
e ma gbadun yen na doctor ugu ni yen e e gbo ti doctor ugu na yen ma to 5 minutes so ko to ton ma wa play kan mi prince eh thank you so much for joining the broadcast this afternoon but ko sin kan tun mo pe so understanding yen o ijaya ijaya mo ke mo ki mo wele mo se you are not going to get the message so e je ka gbo doctor ugu they wanted, they wanted to be separate from the country that the british empire had imposed on us which was this country of nigeria where they kind of just kind of took a bunch of independent nations who don't have anything to do with each other don't even speak each other's language don't relate many of them were even enemies and warring at the time smushed them all together and drew these arbitrary lines around them mm -hmm. and called them countries and named those countries right and then said now y'all get along and do a country for us and be a a union for us and then go through you know contentious bloody independence processes that never really yield any real independence you're still part of a commonwealth afterwards True. and you have the eternal meddling in your affairs and the eternal extraction of your resources and the eternal fomenting of divisiveness and infighting in order to be able to control you this is what an oppressor does a colonizer does uh this is these are you know tactics and strategies of dominance right we were subjected to that as a larger unit of nigeria and then when the igbo people said we want our own thing let's let's go and, and do that well it so happened to be that the territory that this new country of biafra was going to be in included very very rich oil reserves mm. and the british were not going to let go of that wow and the people that they had put in power you know that their puppet nigerian governments weren't going to do that either because they needed it for the nigerian project right and britain needed it for its own interests respond my like question that bearing and why jonathan still nigeria this is a debate, and we like challenges. Am I already on the meeting? One day, Cherry reason T as a change and Julian here is because the structure to Jen and Julian she exists. We got the structure about what she let the structure about what she let in a nation of way. I paid by your bad nation. I won't be a process of one of your bad country. I want to support your evil country. I want to pay your bad nation country. It's not the about the shelly. Jonathan on the Nigeria mo. I'm a whatever if you talk about the life that right here. So more you understand the conti essence of pay. Kilo de Jonathan she the Nigeria. Kilo de Tiko is on part of your nation. This structure you about the wallet. Could I see your way to structure your wallet? Because at least as an educated man as you are, at the book way I won't look or not to break it. I won't look or not break it. My move video that day. We must prepare in the background. What about the boy, Doctor Uguton? Thank you so much for enlightening us, Prince Mudubalo. Eh, need that book, Prince. Understanding in it. If you tell you one more long face sorrow, one shama usa, one shama fulan. No, no, no understanding it. One in Kilo de Ti Jonathan, she in Jena in Julia. Ti Jonathan banso. Jonathan in so history for me. He can tell you that one, one, one parent who after cross a fuma, cross a fuma. So, understanding Jonathan is Nigeria is because that word Nigerian has been removed. No, has been uh, 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 the word Jonathan or What he in 1914. So, what he changed the narrative here, both Ausa Ibo Yoruba. We all contribute backward of Nigeria. No, we don't let back. Because we have to contribute. We don't let back. We don't let British gong gong. Look, that was a lot of people. But I got Dr. Ubutu. I will play the other video, which will cover my screen. In here, I will do screen. But for now, I got to Dr. Ubutu. And uses. So, Great Britain got directly involved in this civil war and in the war for independence and decided that they would do everything to make sure that Biafra did not go. Wow. And this everything meant directly funding genocide of 
the people of Biafra. And they drink, they fornicate, they, also, they do all the things that all human beings do. So it's not a question of religion. There's no, there's no question of anybody being truly a Muslim there. You know, even I'm, I mean, I knew a chief judge who was supposed to be leading uh, uh, Muslim prayers, who anytime he came to me uh, in my official residence, he would put a, a brandy or whiskey in, the, in, 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 in a mug and be drinking, and he would smoke and all that. So I don't think it's religion. When they started this uh, Sharia, how many of them are obeying the Sharia? How many of them? No, not, not none of their leaders. So it's not religion per se, but they use religion to deceive people and say, uh, uh, houses, I mean, houses were not Muslims at all. So they say, well, let's give you a superior religion. We'll give you Islam. But that didn't apply to the South because we've had Muslims in Yoruba land even before 14th century. So truly, what we are fighting against or what is going on is clash of culture. And civilizations. And civilizations. That's right. Not really the Fulani versus the Igbo or the Fulani versus the Yoruba. No. It's clash of civilizations. Yes, clash of civilizations and clash of cultures. Yes, you're right. That means we have not really integrated as a people. Never. We have never been. So the word the Nigerian people is a fallacy. Is that what you're saying? Yes. Because, again, in those days, you will say, eh, there, were, there have always been Igbo markets, there uh, also markets in uh, Enugu. There have always been Sabos in Shagamu. But those Sabos were occupied by Mus by Hausas. Houses are peaceful people. We traded in Kola Nord. We didn't, we didn't. Even the few Fulanis that came with them at that time, when you had a Sabo in, in Chagamo or in Ibado here, they would still look for one Fulani man and make him their Seriki. How did the Hausa accept the they were so, they were the so, they were the subdued. Fulani. They were subdued. Despite their large numbers. Yes, they were subdued. Of course, they killed, they, they ruined, they, 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 they extirpated their seven kingdoms. They killed their seven rulers and took over on, under the guise of religion. Another thing they used, they told, they used the word corruption. Oh, your people are corrupt. We are saints. Your people are corrupt. They've always used the word corruption to deceive people. But the jihad is over. How come the Hausa man is yet to claim that Hausa is again? It's just now that the efforts we are making in the South have, be, have begun to yield fruits. You will be surprised to hear that now in, in Hausa land, we now have Hausa Christians. Never had that before. Never. You have now have Middle Belt Forum that are saying we are not Northerners. We are Middle Belters. We are not Northerners. Don't call us Northerners. Now, when you see a Jukum man or you see a long-term man, and you say you are Hausa or you are Fulani, he will be angry. He may even draw his dagger. Don't call me Fulani. I'm not Fulani. I'm not Hausa. What we did not know until recently is that when you call a Fulani man Hausa, he will be angry. He will say, Banzani. Because he knows that I'm superior to Hausa. Can you say I'm Hausa? But before now, before Buhari came to establish his uh, suzerainty over Nigeria, we all, we all lumped all of them together for uh, Northerners, Northerners, Northerners. And like I wrote some four years ago, there's no north. There's no north that we used to know. There's, the north is dead. There's nothing called north anymore. So there's a Fulani now standing on his own. He's, he's standing on his own. There's no more north. If they try any war today, oh, God of mercy. The kind of cohesion, cohesion you had in the army, the military in 1966, will never happen again in this country, if there is a country at all. You will not find a Hausa soldier now, I mean, an Igbo soldier going to Enugu to kill a fellow, fellow Igbo. You will not even find an Igbo soldier coming to Ibano to kill a Yoruba man. Or a Yoruba soldier going to Enugu to kill an Igbo man. It will not happen again. So the Lantan people, the Benue people will never, ever allow themselves to be used by any Fulani, any Fulani mischief maker. So if I'm getting you right, your argument is that the Fulani hegemony has yeah. been broken. Dead. If the Fulani hegemony has been broken, yes. does it mean that the social, the social structure of Nigeria is about to witness a very hard hit that will lead to a new Nigeria? Yes, for those who agree with you to the extent of the fact that there are still some people who want a Nigeria, uh, a group that I don't belong to. But for such people, yes. Uh, 
with the weakening of Fulani hegemony, there could be a Nigeria that will integrate the sober Fulanese, the town Fulanese, and see reconstruct, rebuild, and then have a Nigeria that should be. But I, as a person, as Tola Deni, believe that it will take probably a thousand years to change the mindset of a Fulani person whose philosophy is kill, maim, rape, send away people from their land, and let me occupy it. That is the bush Fulani. It is the bush Fulani. Not the town Fulani. Not the town Fulani. And the town Fulani is more in number. No! The town Fulani is less than 1%. How did you get that figure? Oh, go and find out. Let them allow, let, them, let us, let them allow a sense. Who are the Fulani? They're very few. The few, the ones, the ones who have in Abuja. Or the few that dot, uh, that dot uh, spaces in Sokoto. I'm sure that, you know, that Sokoto as we speak is not a Fulani, is not a Fulani town. Is it not? No. That's the mistake we make. Sampara is not a Fulani town. There are more houses in Sampara than Fulani. There are more houses in Kano than Fulani. But the Fulani govern. They are in town. They are in charge. Yes, so it's their town. <laughs> yes, yes. By, by subterfuge, by cunning, by, by, by crookedness, by all sorts of uh, gimmick. Or by integration. Not integration. By intimidation. And they are, they, I said they are politically savvy. What they did to the rest of Nigeria, when they realized that the Fulani in the military, they could no longer use the military to retain power indefinitely. Since they've had power they had, and they had, they had access to the treasury, they say, oh yes, uh, Edmond is from the east or wherever. Brilliant man. He may likely oppose us and contest with us and rival us. Let's make him an ambassador. Let's give him an oil block. Let's make him a billionaire. We padlock his mouth. Let's get an abiola. Make him a billionaire. Let's get this. Let's get that. And make them big. They will never be able to look us in the face. Then we can continue. Looting the treasury. We, we can continue. Once we have, when we are, we, are, we, are, we, are, we are in control of the treasury, we are in control of everywhere. So we can hire thugs. We can do whatever we would like. And that is why they introduced what I call plutogarchy into Nigerian political uh, etymology. Plutogarchy. Meaning? Plutocracy is the government of the rich. Yeah. Oligarchy is the government of the Muslim men. Come for the program. Thank you. May I say how delighted we are to be on Passion. We've looked forward to speaking to an African television station for decades. <laughs> this is something we have looked forward to for such a long time, and we are so happy to be here. Thank you. Mr. Aaron Smith was a young, bright, and principled Oxford University graduate who was recruited by the colonial office and posted to Nigeria. He took his final, ex uh, final examination a year ahead of his class. He also married Mrs. Carol Smith, whom he met while they were both at Oxford University. Together they went to Nigeria, where they had their two children. Mr. Aaron Smith, you were featured in a program uh, recently by BBC Radio 4, yes. uh, titled Document, yes. and that was hosted by Mr. Mike Thompson. Yes. You were alleged that the British government rigged the first and most important election in the history of Nigeria in 1959 in favor of the North. Am I correct? Yes. How long were you in Nigeria for? From 1955 to 1960. And we were based in Lagos. I was on the staff of the Department of Labor. I was largely occupied with employment problems, all the employment exchanges, and statistics and international reports and was kept pretty busy. I was also stationed in Lagos in charge of the capital and the port. I was the port labor officer as well and I also devised a port labor scheme 
and later a social security scheme, which was one of the first in Africa, which guaranteed workers some income after they'd finished work. It was a, a Providence scheme, as I say, it was called the National Providence Scheme, and I was very proud to have put that on the statute book. I was going to ask you what your role is. You've mentioned three in Paran. Is there any particular name given to your office while you were there? Just labor officer. I was a labor officer, a senior civil servant. Okay. I only intended to stay in Lagos initially for two tours of duty. Although because of this conflict with the elections, there, was, uh, there were difficulties, actually government wouldn't let me leave the civil service. They were determined that I should stay in the civil service after my two tours. And I was offered very considerable incentives including a knighthood, to stay and work for government. Primarily this was because I had access to the state secrets. I learned, and the Governor General himself confirmed this to me, that the elections were rigged, contrived. The intention was that the North should rule Nigeria. Even in 56, the northern leaders were very proud and were saying, if they couldn't run Nigeria, never mind elections. They might not join Nigeria, they might leave. And we all thought, well, how would they survive? There were no industries, there's not a great deal of agriculture, some groundnuts in the north. This wasn't very practical at all. And then it was, the Governor General seemed to be thinking that the North couldn't, even if it won an election, rule Nigeria by itself. The, the South wouldn't stand for that. So there had to be a partner, either the Igbos in the East or the Yoruba in the West, to team up with the North. What he didn't want was for the two Southern parties, the Igbo and the Yoruba, to team up to form the government, because he believed the North wouldn't tolerate that and talked about leaving the Federation. So as I learned, in a small way at first, but very rapidly I learned about the election fixing, and as I say, this was confirmed to me by the Governor General. He actually said that he wanted me to know the truth because he wanted me to know how much trouble I was in. You mentioned statistics, you were collecting figures. Yes. Is that for labor and unemployed people only, or generally? Prim primarily, but obviously my interest was in the population Of generally. Nigeria. Mm -hmm. Yes, and Awolowo, the Yoruba leader, leader of the action group, yep. and Chief Enaharo, they too, other people were saying, where are all these millions of people in the north? Where are they? We're going up there to campaign. We want to know, you know. And um, you see all these, you know, thousands of miles of not very developed countryside and yet the northerners are claiming that uh, their voting registration figures are larger than in the south you know larger far more people up there well actually if you went through the Igbo land you know Enugu and that you saw lots and lots of people if you went to Ibadan uh, again Ibadan teeming you know, with millions of people but we didn't actually see many northerners, and obviously not many northerners at that time came to Lagos. So this did arouse suspicion. Now, the Europeans, you know, not stupid, we are watching what's going on in Nigeria, and we too are beginning to feel there's something not quite right here, that maybe the elections are not going to be as straightforward as they're meant to be. Nigeria was being described as the showcase of democracy, and it was expected that the nationalist leaders would 
went through. But actually, when the election results were uh, announced by the Governor General, before the vote was even in, didn't vote, didn't count for that, he didn't wait for that. I have to tell you, the British were counting the votes. And the British cannot be trusted. They look after their friends. Loyalty is the big thing for the British. And we were friends with the emirs of the north. We looked on people like Inaharo and Awolowo as rather dangerous people. They might even be communists. That's ridiculous, actually. They couldn't hmm. be communists in a thousand years. But this was a sort of thing that was being said. And we were, as Europeans, were getting a bit worried about all this. It wasn't quite the honest, straightforward election that we were hoping for. Apart from uh, Professor Anderson and Dr. Patrick Wilmot that supported your submission on the rigged election, there were other people who also served in the colonial office uh, in your days. I mean, who opposed to this uh, submission? There initially, I was um, uh, warned of what was going on by my senior officer, a major bunker. I didn't know, and I knew that uh, the Governor General had directed me to take all the office staff of the Ministry of Labour to help Chief Okoti Ebo in politicking in Wari. And this was most irregular, and I refused to do this. Having refused an order, I know what the drill is. You resign. I resign my post. That is the proper thing to do. What they did then was rather devious. They persuaded me to withdraw my resignation, and when I did, they sacked me. It didn't go through, but they, I thought this was a bit low after I had resigned and was prepared to leave the country. This was not very nice behaviour. They later withdrew this and said that I had been of some service to the state and actually commended me for what I had done and said I would, could leave Nigeria with splendid testimonials and we shook hands on this. And this was done with the recognition of the Deputy Governor General, Sir Ralph Gray. And then I left Nigeria the first time and took up a job as a personnel officer, a very big job, with the SO refinery. And then government came after me, declared that I was a traitor and I had betrayed the British people, ought to be imprisoned, and I lost that job. And then they came to me again and said, it's all been a big mistake, a dreadful mistake. I'm a jolly decent chap, you know, Oxford chap. And they put me on a plane straight back to Nigeria where I'd make up for the time I'd been away. There was a great deal of good work for me to do. And we fell for this. We shouldn't have gone back, but we did. Now, um if you recall what you said about the role of the Governor General and the attitude of the British government in particular uh, regarding the fear that Awolowo, Okutiebo and the lot of them from the south are dangerous, is there a particular reason? Why, why the fear from the British government? Is it that they don't want to release or relinquish Nigeria? They still want to they control wanted... Nigeria? They knew that the North would do as they said after independence. If it had any, pro the North would just, because it was their habit, they were, they liked the British, whereas the nationalists were an unknown factor. Actually, on the, when they took the flag down and hoisted the Nigerian flag, not one of the major nationalist politicians was there. They weren't even on the platform. This was incredible. These were the people who had sought independence. The people in the north didn't want independence. They didn't want the British to leave. So this was a farce. And for most Europeans who were very close and watching this, we were disgusted. We thought this really had been manipulated, this election. 
it was unworthy. It was unworthy of the British people, this. This was no honest, straightforward thing that you would expect Britain, the mother of parliaments, to do. This was cheap and low and criminal. And I opposed it. And I opposed it then and I've opposed it ever since. And I'm telling you the truth. And I was warned, if I told you this, this state secret, my life could be forfeit. Earlier on, you said the British government wanted the North in alliance with either of the southern uh, yes. uh, region, either with the Yorubas or with the Yibos. But I mean, with, with, without which they yes, cannot they, they can't do this rule the country. The problem was that a Wallowo was a highly principled man. Okay. You didn't talk to a Wallowo about squalid deals and fixing things. A Wallowo was not that kind of person. If you read his books, this man was a world statesman. And his young lieutenant, chief in... Colonel Thorne Rukai, Arrod Smith. Babakito a reference to him in the... Uh, I think Lepa Pakosibuari. I'm not going to argue with that man anymore because I can see that they are all just stump block. But they know the right thing, but they're living in denial. So I'm not going to waste my energy. I've done what I can explain to him. And he's just playing, he's playing, he's playing around. He's playing me. And I'm not going to give that room anymore. Uh, let me take this call. Hello? I'm not going to argue with background. I mean, background. I mean, background. I mean, background. I mean, 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 Disagree, but look at this. I get can come in there. In tea, I want to join on long, Tom. Oh, I said, I'm going to go to the end. Okay, I'm going to talk about our daddy. In touch, I'm going to sing. A romantic was in 2007. I'm sure I want to be Baba Udo. 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 I want to Talk about them, dearly. But because of the new archive of information to Jadi, we don't find any understanding. Okay, you made a lot money by 1999 Constitution. No way, sir. To work with the destruction, yeah, this is destruction. We want to, we want to leave everything to be there, sir. Because it is wrong, no one will. What we do that way is mad. 
Okay, because I interrupt this in my blue, and that's why they will give Tinubu the backup he needs just to keep that formation going. But in the long run, in the long run, when we have a nation, we will be competing with them based on whether the people to see to be there or dale. Because you can't do dale. The German show and let's see as now to dale against the German and British. So Bobo here is just a normal thing. But the most important thing is Okay. Oh, yeah. I know what don't be by one thing. We see this. I want the basic things long discuss. I want the basic things long discuss. And the Tobashi is a way or a team book of Buddhist of the Buddhist Rubu Malu. I'm fighting him as a complete eight years, four years, no shimmy. Bobon to Malu, call on for a name a good book. I will hate it. Twenty thirty one, the moment of tele, but I'm only looking at the twenty that woman, four years, no shin. By twenty thirty one, don't talk about it, by the next four years, Tinobu will be eighty seven. What next? All our students, la mama ask, or our students say, I want yet the basic things, land so that we want this course here. Current situation, me, Buba, on TNT, so it means so projection of the next Mosoni no program, me, me, Iboni Yoruba Mawa, in another two hundred years, by twenty. 823 Emi Eni Bobo will be gone by 2823, that's 800 years. Amati one in 29th century. No, we are talking about a long term. Uh, so no, hold that one. Because these are the current situation of things. There's nothing wrong in that. Move on here. Yeah. I want to Okay. When you are you I want I want English. I want any single. I want ing I want English no she share yet. But but we are if you are one ta at the English no eh now is another argument show my phone was select or fail select i think battery cube share the most important thing t and your t get me quick Share me see key beating which one you know system for law of full army i think we go join your bad nation for the one in the same territory because the first thing that of it nullify me quick identity and i couldn't call this in who comes around and get up more don't be identity so identity you don't go over important you know you can okay kid there okay more okay more you can let one so my reason to the boy is don't you say you go to the design come on by probe they say let go go no she resign so they are smart so consider you but you need to join you to the yoruba nation yes to the yoruba nation, yes, nation as at the time of one the better way the article come out by identity wa i don't know what she don't pay me politicking i don't know what don't pay she also need to know what she's going to do don't know what she's going to do i'm not going to do it i'm not going to do it i'm not going to do it i'm a draft the constitution i'm not going to do it i'm not going to vote me just sunday on the 18th for a new constitution she could take it in a book proposed for constitution amendment change no 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 not even amendment yeah yeah, we need to do that. We have to go to the because only ambition. Who only go fishing because who only local. Only Yeah. Oh yeah, definitely. What we are here? 
No, 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 so now, a minimum, a minimum, and this should never be a big problem. At the late minute, it's a waste of time. I'm gonna cut it. I'm sorry, okay. Gong. A minimum program, a minimum control narrative, believe it. Eh? Because we think the kind of young people only move for any preference. That's fine. Now, say anything about the regional government. Shall I say? So, kilo de tashiri say anything about? So, kilo wa fun ni pressure pe ani ani ri Yoruba ni so yen se. Oh, the same thing. No, I took para saying here. If any suru that day, because we are in any suru, no go here and so here. It's because we are in a system that is not working. I just give you one clear example, and I'm going to cut off because we need to move further to the program. It's too late with the interval. Now, the matter model in 1998. All of Abada and Drew to ban only insurance after three years. Insurance. Chair, we call it confirm insurance. Yes, let's say yes. Paper last on the man phone. Hello, me share insurance. Yes, if you are local, sir, talk about the document. What we realize is, ah, Timo to buy an accident. And it's not only insurance. Oh, the pay insurance. Yes, go and valid it. Oh, the thing though, insurance. Yes, for one year, we need to cancel it. So, what? Kill it for what? She will upgrade the system. So, if you don't stop me, I will control that. I will control that. Go that most of you people Boris Johnson. He did to share his that. He became a polo politics. He did by. He did to share his that. He became come about. He go go shake it, shake it, and see less at all. So all resign. So in the sense that we say about the country, say I'm no say today I'm missing. I draw sin on Nigeria. I'm a donority with different identity. Say but say no identity to Danny sin. Say we love Danny. No. I want to support a piece. I want to need that impression. I want to enjoy eight years. If you want to want to support it, you want to be in 2031, you want to be in 2031. Say not to be in 2031. I want 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 to be in 2031. And the southeast, Moambi Katomalo, Tao Tonon and does it in Ubuye, Tano Iboloma de Boyasi, Sodo Iboni, Aboda Usa, the twenty thirty one. So, see any Abawa Debe, Bobo Walla, Titi Nubuashe, Yababa, Timubu, Toshi Walla, Lokoshi Toshibo. See any Abawa Debe, Tobabe, Sinchen, the Bobo, because of my change of it in the book, if you don't know your if you have a book, you will be able to see it. You marginalize it, you will not But that is just a short-term situation. So that is about it. So I'm going to go now because after the 12 minutes, uh, I should go on it. Yeah. Uh, okay, but uh, no, not any uh, again. Not any suru. Me but the interior violence. You know what I'm saying? She's like that. Ah. I'm sure we're violent. I'm sure we're not going violent. Uh -uh. Oh, 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 no, no, I want our family to come to the Eh, so the band is violent. Let's see, I've been next enough to become a family. There is nothing about eh monto eh ba monto ko violent ni e lowo awon IRA in ton ko violent ni there is no violent in Yoruba nation even our utterances is not violent because i ti ko bon sita i ti no rawa ni ginisale voice laughing barawa so 
you're not an angel, so non violent name. Oh, yeah, right. I'm gonna let you go. You don't let Patova do good. Our winning Obolonja and Ukraine to monitor the social media. So, we say we have as many people that want Yoruba nation, but they are still having these mind. They are keep in Nigeria, they are safe in Nigeria. Hey, they are safe in Nigeria. Saving Nigeria is as not saving your life. We are talking about identity of people. The identity of people land is cost. The identity of people that are important, indigenous people. So how can you say, eh, okay, ah, negotiate Pelutinubu, la coleta si, even though he hasn't respond. So the topic today is all about negotiation, consultation, diplomacy. So all these sentiments, it's a temporary measure. Tinubu is just a temporary measure. It is not going to be there forever. Tinubu can share up at all control of Nigeria. So that no show to gun control Nigeria. Do not feel that he has been at the Ikuba by the at the Oba Ojaja. Do not know if so. So that no show to only he do not know Nita because do not know about what is in Nigeria. I want out. I want English. He don't know English. Whether British. I want to go. What my cocoa lost all the salta. What fool salta no chocolate only more or war. Do or ballet you ballo. I'm sure we will have one for money. What fool or bass salta no chocolate. What fool near war. Do I want ballet you ballo. So kill a one jap. She is that time. Jay, say that a two push a student loan. Kill my body student loan. Temporary measure no boy. Obama is a student loan. Oh, what run government. We expect you to to run a government. We expect Bola Tinubu, your president, to run a government. Take a one if run government. He has to run a government and he has to form a government. And forming a government does not mean he has to now disagree with our own views as Yoruba indigenous people. We are indigenous people. Bola Tinubu knows the history. Seven pages as compared to So this notion, pay a え、え、え、え、え、え、え、え、え、え、え、え、え、え、え、え、え、え、え、え、え、え、え、え、え、え、え、え、え、え、え、え、え、え、え、え、え、え、え、え、え、え、え、え、え、え、え、え、え、え、
is a temporary mayor. Kerry go boy kato she yi in kato ki pesi no ni o. Oro no bon bon foro yaro ni ba yi. I don't, I don't like it so much. They don't want to feel all your own. Of course, to ban him is an account of people are. But what the mama paru? Mama yo. Kerry, I want to take you to the party shop. I want to look better there. A salon key room she logo is not that people are on. He is where they want to be power. Let's go to put on a leo. I want to go against it. I want to be on the other. I want to be on the other. I want to put on the issue. He's going to do many things. I want them. I know I want to be able to put in common with them. That is what is killing us. It's even happening in the churches. They are my one. I believe me. That is why churches are like that. It happens everywhere. Kerry Kadoche is temporary. There. Eja kama wipi uti ito kuda ata Mipo unikano chinche joba neba yu Anwa kashi uwo boya wa shi maa boya Anwa kashi nduru anwa Anwa usa yewe shi nduru kini 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 situasyon kotu maa baja di kilo maa baja di ni He cannot be doing this smoothly like this And anwa usa yewe mama uwo Bupo kato unta chi uwo yewe shi maa maa baja Si sende iti kamba se tuto Yara chom politi joma vote shu any policy, don't have a vote for me. I will see. I got the way. I want to know that you can be the majority. Tell me how bad you don't have to. Did you want to see me pay? Let me tell you. I need to solve the thing. Oh, solve the thing. But get the money. Money can be shared with me. Is it the only one to be shared with me? I can make you go buy a mat. I can buy. You know what I mean? You think that is how the government is being prepared? Kerry, I want your time. Go and lay it. I don't know. Kerry, go to one day. I am still going. I'm continuing to say this. We should get our money. Oma, you are going to make reference to what I'm saying. Kerry, that the man said to the man, the man that he will say to the people, they call to party. They want to buy the boy. Boy, she loves the boy. She might do. By the time the man is born, do not turn. The man is born. We should make your duka. I am telling you this. Believe it or not. They are not happy about it. Um, I am very sure no more to see. I may tell you, I want my people to be able to pay. What is up? We cannot do anything. Can they come? Eh, whatever, whatever. Everybody try to get our way. I mentioned this all alone. We cannot settle anything. I was telling somebody yesterday. That forget about it. People just look and pay the camera. She said, "Ah, no, it is more than that." When I was student loan, the power to take a copy, the people who will not be busy now finance it. That's the first thing. Who will not be able to finance it? Come here. I want you to come to the company. Yeah, I want to buy the committee. To buy the new year gun. Can we do it? Go away, hello. Then a year gun. Then we do our money. We don't know the law. We have the opportunity. To run one like that, I am not going to go for one. What are we talking? Man, those are all here. Yeah, oh, God, so I want to move on. Oh, one, one, yeah, one leg in there. They don't put you up by right now. One day, I get come and chill up. One day, I wait on it. And my brother, there is nothing anybody can do in that nation. I kept on saying it. So, I said to them, I'm not going to go to the house. I'm not going to go to the house. I'm not going to go to the house. Before you know, I'm not going to go to the house. Take, take, take my word. God bless you. Bless you. Uh, we will open the phone line uh, since uh, it's still part of the discussion. Negotiation. Because if continue, we will to negotiate. Number them up is you know, I do for the phone in broadcast in TMC plus 44 hour life presently now. It's really me, man, but program later. See about who don't know, mama show life for you, but. We are live presently now, and the time is just 40 minutes past 1 p.m. local time in London. It is the 15th of June, 2023. I will allow the calls to come in as we continue the discussion. Plus 44 My name is Olami Koiki. Uh, I'm expecting a signal. That's it. Team Wakoni. event. Uh, 
uh, Oshun. So hopefully if I get that signal, we will migrate this program slightly into it. But so far, uh theory signal. Eh? So, but if the signal comes, we might switch to that event, uh, you know, while we will continue uh, monitoring that event. Uh, I am always happy. I want to really factor the long term. Nigeria has a problem to fix responsibility. I have a problem to fix. I have a problem to fix. I have a problem to fix. Lot of problem to my fix friend, you know, the economy in Nigeria. Lot of problem to my fix, oh no, the security in Nigeria. Lot of problem to my fix, oh no, the people stabilize it or cut on in Nigeria to the occurrence they be by. So, Bobby occurrence, my duro pada, Kusila or Tinubu, Tinubu gone, they make his ship in a coastal pada. Nigeria to the Titanic to be what it will be. So, Tinubu can try, lot if a pilot there and they go to the bishop. Yeah, hello. Yeah, yeah. Uh, yeah. 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 There is no money in Nigeria, but Latin will need a lot. We should work at the money, Baba Victor or Labambo. I want your Bola John Soro, maybe by, maybe by your kinship fracas, maybe by him discourse, Nepal. Total disintegration of what is called that Nigeria. Uh, it's not a violent movement. I think people that are mixing it up with a violent movement. This is a movement of intellectuals. Only that people in town bought it at and consider Florence for the uh, for that coffee. Uh, you know, on, on that kind of what we call the super chat. But ah, the super chat. So you know, the only avenue that you can support us is through all those revenue, either PayPal 
First Bank, you know, all those account details, don't look at yellow scroll. So the bad name Barclays and Tele is no longer working. New account details on loan be looking at tied. So suppose, even I need to edit that. It's not zero zero zero. It should be koiki we come and judge about edit that after the program. Because about our bonus so many messy we will broadcast it. Muki Baba Jimo, shout out to you as well. More the care interval lorry mix ella. We are just two hours twenty six minutes. Uh, even though we've not talked a lot. But we've done a lot of video and because that is a 50 minutes but let me quickly move further into the conversation how do we negotiate with tinobu bao la shifi negotiate with lwe she ako ma joko si inu conference room tinobu wajawai because i see this as a conference room everybody is right inside yato konipe a arirawa but i'm communicate you know and then go out of the want to get leaders who are team one that the urban nation but in the in the real world <laughs> creative action thank you for flogging on it then you know in the real world how do we literally have a negotiation with the government do you know one one negotiate one negotiate I'm still going to do this program again, uh, you know, because I'm going to be able to negotiate with Ludukon. I'm going to be negotiate. I shall remember to kick off with a bit of understanding, just a small bit. That is the way forward. We need to negotiate with our own Yoruba president, Paul Atinubu. You know, even though he's not a Yoruba president, but he's a Yoruba man. Ah, the Yoruba Kuro. He's not a Yoruba. Am I come out of the world? He's a Yoruba president. He's a Yoruba man. It's an advantage. But we only advantage and disadvantage. And want to share politics. You know, what fail Lotinobu as the last card? Share it on politicians. You are hmm. T war, but for your son, come. He said, "Pay Tinobu is their last hope." By the time see, I wish I me bad baby. Oh my dream, oh bon, bon bon talk go job. Oh my bad, oh you know something look on. Oh something look on, oh my bad, cool oh you. And they will now deal with every single one of us. So even our today politicians in the southwest, in the Yoruba, Tinubu is their final card. Because by twenty thirty one, after October twenty twenty seven, see what about to feel me? We are off. Vote for again. Now, how do we negotiate? It's a conversation. She let her come like a to negotiate with Lutinobu. No, it doesn't work like that. I want Baba Mani team to go on standby. Tell me, Tinobu Bani, or will Tinobu committee to go to Baba on Soro? Or will Ebola be there? She told me, I want to. I'm a joke, okay? Oh, every only about to three years. Only about to one year. Only about to buy six months. No. Negotiation is a continuity. I think negotiate by the APC prior before where Tinubu came in. What do I mean by that? We send a letter to Buari. That is a negotiation. Any communication between anybody. Kira Rope NLC touch and negotiate. Now one negotiate in any was she was strike because oh, I can strike it to an Nigeria and see, and that would have put a pressure. Thank you so much again. Babawa Olua Shion Fun Coffee Terra Fun Alori Coffee Bot Tea is a new kind of you know system that is just there. And they send it through UK Barclays account. And then my son, I need the work more familiar. Full ad bar, the first coche, the metro. Only God knows how much talk about our one. Our shared bar, and even ad bar to follow my dad in the YouTube to be JB or not small revenue. YouTube is up with video magic on one or reported. Coche, I want you, but federal government asks that that video is just too powerful. More please, well, you want only know. So, Kidimon, thank you so much for the support for those of you that are supporting, even in prayer. Is enough for me to keep going. Now, as many Yoruba people see, eh, they can support the Babakinto. We can negotiate. 
ki le wa fe ki baba ki to ye se baba mo pe negotiation o ma wa ye awon external negotiation kan na ma wa won le ma reveal e fun wa e je ka wo good friday agreement se uk ni kan lo nbebe pelu awon ira e ri pe america na ba won da se igba ti bi clinton wa ni be ati soro nipa ira ti ba te show in anything gbogbo ala mo nipa ira nipa ti negotiation yen lo igba te mi ma de lu ni 1998 98 yen was signed agreement to fin pe ni good friday agreement so she ela bi no family come first hello yeah <laughs> <laughs> It might be no uh, family, very, very important. So, as I was saying, negotiation is a powerful message. But part of negotiation would also mean that our civil disobedience must be out as well. That is not a violent way. Protest, rally, leaflet, continue talking, whether on any platform, online, offline. But I won't look on what see Mumma Pamba by Mama make effort. Lati push for president in Nigeria. Oh, better key go going law. Those are something that will not come to the public domain. Everybody knows that. So I want to see now, Master Fu, federal government, we or a two and let go and show or bullets. Go and show or a bomb or a two and let or a man or joke or a joke or so. Make your request there, but your joke or get your so. Situation there won't be so done. Oh, my kid is sitting in Nigeria. Oh, my affect everybody. Because it only affect. And don't be on Nigeria. Oh, really long in Nigeria more. For some time. So, that's why it's a very decade. I think the key open window because so far, you see, open window lawa. We got the window about to close. That means that our teeth is bought our year for one year, two years, three years. That's both big bad. But at my father's around them. So, why then is it difficult for any government? Let the people go to the But I won't be patient here because they are hoping that they can steer the ship that has gone drain. Nigeria to the Titanic, or to Alabi Omi. Titanic, he gone like Jordan, not to one more abele. Nino Mitowa, but we'll be your contoshe, projection. Why, till or pull a daddy, Nino Abbe Mitowa. Shawari Titanic. Tin Nigeria, then I want to jam on Bogi Bogi. I want to celebrate. What can she be at that way? Or can you tear it? Titanic tear it. Most of it, oh no one, Nigeria, or the driver. Lati bitowa lo sinu state ti ko to be o gboro ko as many extra security che ti nugu ma wa se to ma relieve awon lowo pe to ba pe sare lo je bu ode won ni di security so negotiation awon ba to je oba le yoruba bo fe boko won gboro ba tinubu soro to ta ba ba tinubu soro again it's going to come back on them ni tori pe ti tinubu ba ma fi setan ti eh ti kuro ninu nigeria eyan mo nigeria tejo mo yoruba nibe 
awon ba yin le ma fe konramo o e ma konramo ba yen so is an advantage but that advantage can also become a big disadvantage the north might not like whatever step to fegbe they will have to adhere with it one must accept it this program runs down at exactly 24 minutes only three hours long so the advantage that we are pushing now be eje ka jojoko ka jogbe yewo yoruba nation ta npariwo ko le stop because of tinubu ko le stop because of awon bale yoruba it is a right and that inalienable right will be respected just as any other countries are asking for the same tinubu is just a number out of so many yoruba people Oh, wow, opportune, but it's not going to be here forever, just as so many of us as well. It will be here, it will not be here, but not here, no. But one thing is, the last card that I'm saying, that if he does not play the card in the narrative, autonomy for local government, look, Titi nubu ba shekwe ki autonomy wa fun local government. Titi nubu ba shekwe ki autonomy wa fun local government. Titi nubu ba shekwe ki autonomy wa fun local government. No, kile ma shekwe si. She e e en robe. Oh, she rokwe wike no. Inu an ife du gbo wike president. Ni 2031. If not 2027. Tefe kwe wike o ti no wo to to do pa mo. Tole, tole hold titi di another four years. Lati complete belu ti nubu. To ba wa complete belu ti nubu ni 2027. Toba pe ko bit the 2031. Why do we have to make Nigeria a practice ground? What a practice in Nigeria for 63 years. It has failed. 63 good years. Ni have to be practice in Bangkok, Nigeria. It did not have failed. But back in 2018, clearly, it's nothing more than the fact that we have what they called nationality problem. Nationality problem, Gongo Lani, Kuniko Ponche by Lue, Office Agege, a Titi Oda, a Eji Ebi Pai and Jay, a Jacoco, your do nationality problem. Tabati, your do yet, then we will be on the right track. So, an average person in Nigeria, at Enito Anita, we are all the same. Enito Anita Kowa, a little bit better than Enito Anile. Tinobu is not going to fix. Nigeria as much as you want because Nigeria is going through a turbulent. But I will not watching Safun Akwe Oshile Walk at Bontigo once on the river. Yes, I'm satisfied. We are still existing as a united nation after that little fracas. Thank God we are, we've made it to six years. And I hope we'll make another 60 years. I may not be here, yeah. but that is my, uh, my, uh, you know, my belief. Always to keep Nigeria one together and to really make sure that there is a better. Sorry. Yeah, okay. So, so, so. so sorry. Uh, and make Nigeria better. No, no, yes. No, no. And what's your advice for the politician, right. the Nigerian politician? It's look okay. at the legal process, okay. you know. No, look, uh, yeah, no, the, that one, you do your best and be a loyal Nigerian, love Nigeria, good or bad. And whatever it is, if it is bad, try to make it better. Uh, if it is good, try to make it even be better. Better, well, best. Let's yeah, make it best, okay? So th this is my attitude, and this is the reason why you know, any government, I have always supported every government uh, that, in fact, you know, uh, that, that started in this country. And I will continue to support... Uh, support. Impediment to Yoruba development is the impediment to Yoruba development. Without Nigeria, we will be where we are. Now we to who are far ahead of South Korea and North Korea. We are far ahead of China even. We had television before France. We had radio before South Africa. Now look at where we are today. 
I think it's a shame that even any young woman can be talking about restructuring at this point in time. What are we restructuring? This, this, this country that is already shot to pieces? I don't think that's what we want. But they are always talking about giving Nigeria a chance. The process of Yoruba Niger with Nigeria has come to an end. A compare or a midi. A compare and tickle one is so. Can compare when you tickle me. Georgia can learn some men. Go on is saying that even if Nigeria is good or bad, problem to one, you can't fix it. So they know that Nigeria is not good. Neither is it bad. But we know that it is so bad that we, the indigenous people, have been affected. Our identity is being run under a false country called Nigeria. Our real identity, hey, Omo Yorubani is the tallest man, but Nigeria long Pinita. But Oruko Yoruba, don't you call on phone, okay, brother, I don't know, Abilano then. So we are being told that we are who we are not, and we are saying that it cannot work in the long run. Hello? 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 I'm going to say it briefly because we have just about less than 20 minutes. Okay, sir. Uh, I'm going to. Hello, I'm going to. I'm going to. I'm going to. I'm going to. The only thing we tell you about Tony Pay, King Jesus Christ, we are not being more. Go watch Nigeria. Go fix Nigeria. Tony. Thank you so much. And the push So we all know that. But I want to know me a lemma chef for you. Whether you're a bad nation, whether it's in Nigeria, a good tiba by so. Now, you see, yes. you, Abina, you have everything going for you. And I don't want you to feel discouraged. Please, things are bad in Nigeria. But I believe it's only for a short time. Because it depends on you. Whatever my generation might have done wrong, and I will be the first to admit that my generation has done a lot, a lot wrong, it's for your generation to do it better. And don't just sit down and complain. Don't just sit down and complain. Sitting down and complain is like the anger of the cripple. 
you're on the same time, you will be on the same ground, on the same level, but you have to be proactive. And you have to make sure you get enough of what I call critical mass of people, like-minded people, who will be ready to say, yes, we can bring about the change. And you can bring about the change if you get the uh, critical mass of people that are ready to slog it out. I always say when people say, hey, well, when will this old hag go out of the way politically? They won't go out of the way. You have to make them go out of the way. They won't voluntarily go out of the way. You have to make it uncomfortable for them. I'm not talking of violence, but bringing, bringing pressure to bear to make it uncomfortable for them. Koike Media, bringing the world closer to your doorstep. As the as the man saw, sorry. Now we are only about to man busy. Only about to cook in busy. What you learning here? The next one, the Madini. The next one, Madini. One minute. So, Alan saw for you. The Roman nation only shake. I'm not answering. So really, you know the same. Koiki Media bringing the work closer to your doorstep. And then the 23rd of August 2022. So really, no. What you ready to depart? Sorry, computer, me. Oh, my Tileku. Oh, that we send so. We have to feel Wally. We have to have to listen. We have to listen so for you. So really, next one to my day. To my day, one minute. It is not to kill it. It's not to love. So, my day, I'm going to go to the Yoruba Nation. It's possible. I'm going to go to the Yoruba I'm going to go to the 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 to to go to to your hearts are divided. We know that. Hearts you are divided. And we're talking about a ETM, a support movement in Tele. Lock back on. Other people, could a single control wrong when we are understandable who send it to the wrong when we are then sherry we are to see power sherry in a lot of any buluka lukushi won't come when in tomorrow so and to my go or not see tinobu is running a government already and i don't think we are disturbing this government but we are only asking for the right that we are not going to beg for, just like this. Other, Other countries, countries were, were refused at first, but we have to remember, and this is a really important point, that self-determination is an inalienable international right and a law as well. And other countries will recognise Scotland's democratic choice expressed at the ballot box um, they will recognize that because that is the route that many other countries have taken in order to become independent. And just to make that point that international law is very pragmatic on that point. So we should have... So, Kilawan Shetoyato. Let me show you the last background before we go. Money negotiation is something that everybody, especially on the fair independent just like I want to face ah, Prime Minister I'm at Yari Ke I'm at the law immigration judge the last time I want to get legal immigrant I'm not a Shanua UK and that's it new way I'm not a key of 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 
Immigration Enforcement. Today, I joined Immigration Enforcement Officer on operation to, come to clamp down on illegal working. This work is key to delivering on my promise to tackle illegal migration and stop the boat. Here is why. Ara reason that na just apa fair control border wa to so pe tinubu tinubu o le control border wa temporary measure ni ara reason that she fe gba yoruba nation ni mo fe kayo criminal gangs use black market jobs to encourage people to come to UK illegally iyo ije mo ye to je illegal people to wa dinu southwest lagos state ten so pe 20 million ta ba gbo 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 kuro that was see a woman in Nigeria, Tony Wright, to the old Boma Ibo Kuro in there, or the Leboma Usa. I'm talking about a woman, a yami, Lati other countries, T war were documented. But a woman Ibo, they call them face, to the way a woman run the business to put you in Lagos State. I want to one loan, the property, don't run your mother, don't call it, I shall really need to work in Lagos State. I want to go, I want to be there, T war, new way. Even though we are West African, talk coincide in Nigeria. Talk one in Lagos State. Taba bon 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 kuro. I see your one million kuro. You know twenty million here. Ara listen to me now. If you're urban, you know. Criminal gangs use black market at the issue to encourage people to come to UK legally. Mama Kimba, ma yeah she goni yawa olaji rekoka from the super chat. TSN true COVID, uh, COVID, coffee, uh, software, tea, actually, be daddy, because since we don't have this super chat anymore, it's a way to say, Koiki, thank you so much for about five dollars. One of you, mommy, uh, to back back, but lot of you be very man. I do the day. We are so grateful because since that super chat was removed, at least there's always other ways. I'm not like paper, not a person, they see, Musa Kalam one. At yahoo.com. Thank you so much, every single one of you. We are almost time out. We need to do three hours, but illegal working. Illegal working put vulnerable people at risk of exploitation. It also means people with the right to work here are being treated. If it means anyway, I tell you to feel what's in the people. If one more legal state, to power around my Yoruba, to be no see quite media. If you don't be no see some old people. I want to get illegal people. Most of my people, my people, can share illegal immigrants. The Lagos State, forget it. As long as I'm not going to Nigeria, all my Wusa at a one year to cool one year right. That is one in Lagos State. Because since I tell you, she's here. I should have moved from you. Illegal work puts vulnerable people at risk. Working here illegally defraud the public purse. As their businesses and workers do not pay taxes. It is provide these services for you because I want to share illegally We have a clear plan to tackle illegal migration, and our approach is working. But we have to tackle illegal migration. So it is entirely up to those of you. That think that Tinubu will resolve the problem. So I want Scotland to move money. See, Scotland self determination. I want Scotland. Constitutional Secretary, the UK government is obstructing democratic choice made by the Scottish Parliament, undermining Scotland democracy and self government that the people voted for. Ara Scotland is in complain. Farabale, good morning, bye bye, Fiso. Post Brexit evidence and examples of UK government ministers increasing control over Scotland's devolved powers and imposing legislation without the consent. Imposing legislation without consent. Imagine Scotland, T O Y, at least a little bit independent. Tobago, Scotland, one in Premier League, one, one my long by work up. We were independent, but one day he no want to do. He to repay UK to get England or impose legislation without their consent. Any more you know? But if you most of my baby by looking my book book book, can't do that be foreign relationship policy. 
forget about Guba Mo, Ashirin La Shirike Kere, oh, le ni mo, big on she walk. Nick Bata was Scotland bashing complain. You want more Yoruba, one Nick, I'm not complain. Or on your Yemu, Mumma Kimba, Miami, Odumosu, Adio Adishola. If I see a war as Scotland in complain, the paper we publish, Tabata, we paper we publish, or that people are collected on the paper, Lily. In your command, no, but document it, or if you document it, anybody, I want gullible idiots. La brother, in Nigeria, a one believe nonsense, Tia, a ya jagger, we don't so funny, a ya bontiara pony, so, and to my lord, dear. The paper we've published sets out post Brexit evidence. The paper we publish. Just as the waiter called money a man negotiating me at a negotiation when the paper, paper, the day, covers of paper, paper, white paper, in your consumption of country. And one bit of Asha, Asha, I'm Toro Pay, Kofi, or Makari, this 2023. She a noma, sir. And it don't follow the politics. She a noma. You are a noma. You got 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 Stupid bomb bastard. And examples of UK government ministers increasing control over Scotland. Only UK government all control Scotland devolution of power. Learn what you as this Moria Jari. So, ah, am going download the video. I can go to download it. So, you come out with my mama. I go to my video. So, you come out with my mama. Out of my mama, pressed of time. I'll be about uh, time with your pressed of time anyway. When you go to my side. So again, download it. Hello, there. Hello, so download it now. Can you quite well do it? Let me move it download it. Download now. Uh -huh. So my lady, love work for me. Yeah, download. Ara the technology she done here. So you want my boom, you come on, key, do quality in my power for me 2022. I'll be 2023, rather. So we download video. I'm a analysis that in a T Bishop additional. Like the analysis in this particular video. I want to turn the power. One only one control power. You know, they can't worry. You want to own the power. Money better than the power. Can't get better. It's all about the logo. Okay, let's go. I got button delay. The whole powers and imposing legislation without the consent of our nation's parliament. Hollywood. The government of Westminster has taken decisions in devolved matters such as public service spending. They've blocked legislation passed by our Scottish ah, Parliament. You, Baba, Monty, my it don't be man, you know, no man saw he. And my mama, Baba, sorrow, I won't kiss expression, but she's expression. The body of Jeb, which ain't coro. It don't go around, so it don't be one who get deep. It don't upset you, won't get deep. I will let the commission be sure. Book of Bailey Paddy, a Jago de Leto. Process for obtaining a gender recognition certificate. Gender recognition. <laughs> easier and implemented the internal market uh, Act against the wishes of. Against the wishes. Ah, I want to go. Lan, 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 lan. Against the wishes of the Welsh Parliament. Book okay, triple A D R S. Money to buy the borrow Nipa or Rabaye. And the other platform, Kelo Borish Rishi, but about the people who borrow and buy a policy, foreign, brown, you're saying possibly you should operate. What's your operate? I'm only saying operate. I'm only listening to the world. That you pay, one time they pay, I won't know what do. No, she pay the sense of when you want to see England, you see, hey, you know, so when you want to see Tinoku, catch a one bend, you say, I'm better now, but a young Yoruba, a little high for you to repay a year, Tinoku, or do a superior to them in sorrow. Stupid people all over the place. Both the Scottish and Welsh parliaments. The Internal Market Act has made it more difficult for our parliament to bring in environmental protection measures like the single use plastics ban and our deposit return scheme. It also means Scotland may have to accept products from elsewhere in the UK that do not meet our safety standards, hmm. like genetically edited food. Hey. But it wasn't always like this. So, it wasn't always like this before the BRICS exit referendum. UK government did not kill me. For the Brexit referendum, UK governments did not pass new laws affecting Scotland. Ah, you're the people UK. Oh, for one left one. UK. UK. Oh, da. It's powers without consent of our parliament. However, the current UK government 
So mo pe ti vote to so yen owo la so ni gbogbo wa pe agbara ode sale bo ba won ti nubu ko pu power o di bo ko power wa si local government temporary measure ni government ni lede ko yo kuro tori ti nubu oni ni same mo buari o ni same mo o ku 5 minute fun mi so agency are button without consent nine times and it's expected to do so again with the retained eu law bill ignoring the views of scotland ignoring for like be yen Ignoring the views of the Yoruba people. So, to the petty Nubu and even the sea, can you ignore views in Tigoba or Yoruba? Labe, Babawa, Oraku, Adebanja Kitoye, at YSDA. Views of Scotland's democratically elected representatives and putting animal welfare. Putting animal welfare and workers' rights. And you're there, animal welfare. Munizun in Nigeria. There, workers' rights. And food standards. Eh, you tell, you tell, you tell, you Taken together, the evidence and examples set out in this paper demonstrate a worrying trend in obstructing the choices made by our Scottish Parliament. The UK government is eroding devolution. Eh, hey, eroding. Yes, sorry, low English dictionary. Thomas of Wincon eroding. Kilo me. A bobo shape for UK government. Erode. Erode. It be gradually wear away. Tabawani, what does eroding mean? To eat into or away by slow destruction. So in those on the way, UK government is eroding devolution. Opa devolution. Kilampe ni devolution. And they can mean in devolution. Tabasali lo mean in devolution. Katomalo. Tabani devolution. What is devolution in England? Devolution is a transfer of powers and funding from the national to the local government. It is important because it ensures object pay that decisions are made closer to the local people communities. Or see dissolution or not. So, meaning Devolution. Again, devolution. 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 The transfer or delegation of power to the lower level, especially by the central government to the local or regional administration. So, one is okay. UK government in Tin Shekini OT erode the devolution and power to one. And the self government. Self government that the people of Scotland voted for. The people of Scotland voted for. This is a very powerful message. Munila to lower paper and later. The paper we've published okay, paper in the day. So, I'm a ship program in the lorry, then download it straight away. PDF me. I hit our lorry koi key group me. I'm a send a sibe, a riba. So, let me. So, we must send a sibe. We to download it. I send a sibe. I hit our lorry koi key media group chat. Even come on the send a si. The body they upload a sorry. You to uh, only quick media now. So devolution since the bia, bia, bia Brexit referendum summary. Book of a briefly me. Time it you are up already because of other engagement. So kako okay. Oh not be that here. Okay, that's fine. So Tabanika Sari will listen. Eric again expanded. Yeah. Devolution since the bia, Brexit referendum summary. This paper set out the impact of devolution and on the powers and responsibility of the Scottish Parliament of the key UK government decision since the referendum on European Union withdrawal in 2016. Hello? 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 I saw a little. 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 I saw a it's not even worth mentioning on this platform. Okay. Sorry, guys. 
e le person for me i'm sorry kolo mo ko kolo mo ni awon yan wa je ge mi ti mama reference si lori ko iki media kolo mo ko o ku lo mo ni i'm sorry e yin yan ko mi pe lo kan lo mo e bi ta ma so de ni e so any at the stop the program here in last minute ko mi pe o kolo mo awon yan wa je ge bi ti mama so lori live show mo ki mo gbe ile an kan si dare e yin yan wa olayo mi ko iki ni mi je a ma soro A ma soro, le yi eh, ijo mi lori program. E je ka fisi le be, lori e toti te lu. Eh, my views have always been the same. But I will not go further than babaki to ye. Te o ba ni la ka ye. O ye ni sen, yi wo adi agbo. O ye ni sen. I am an intelligent man. Ti ba soro, peace, yi bi ba. Mo kon so to ripe mo mo kwe na ga mu lo ko ju gbogbo yin eyin e fe ki baba kito e ma jade ko wa so fun pe a ma pin a ma pin nigeria ba yo gun in ti mo duro leyen mo change but i am also a man of peace so if you are talking nonsense a je pe brain e o ti wa fry bi jojo adeyin you are born bastard ni mo so fun e yo lo si eyan mo kekeke te wa lo social media e te da kokun mo so mo ki gbogbo yen to ku jare uh, Tibani ama ajogun so mo gboro promote another avenue feyan mo yoruba abi be ko don bastard ni e ma lo prepare mind ni be yin ba neja bi ja ba de emi ni ko so mo mole bi ja be re emi ni ko di mo mole o o ye ni sin in to ma no yin legba o wa ni system lowo lowo e ni ro jeje e ni rin olo e ni 24 hours electricity aye yin ma o ma se kini a ma squeeze in am a fresh new ju mo so fun pe atijo wa ninu 8 4 years e we can get years 4 years tinobu emi na nle kokon iwo na ma leti e to ba ma pe di 4 years emi a reveal e bi te mi ba se de ko so pa ti ma so lo social media ni se emi na share ni pe background tori pe mo pe so fun yin pe aye o le da to te ni pelu tinobu to wa ni be oju a ma jo pade ni 2027 ni ba ti ma reveal e ise te mi na se leyin from pasta Koi ki mi dadi mo nje mo ki bo wale nkan si e ja gbo idon si bo ka to ma lo si ile eh mo ki omode we ka gba lagba iti ba so to ba te lorun lo sinu omi okun o ja sinu be to ba de ni tete yo e fine to ba de re ni tete yo e o doku ni e The love is too much. The love is too much. Too much. Too much. Too much. Too much. But for now, we will make and push for every effort for diplomacy and negotiation. Advantage in the team budget. We will use all every cash in negotiation. We are making every negotiation. Possibility can see negotiation. Ah, me lati like it in Ubu. I man negotiate the way. Oh my bonus you alone, whether he likes it or not. And on that note, enjoy the rest of the afternoon. I'm not too sure if I'm gonna come back tonight. If I do, fine. If I don't, you'll see me again in the lecture room. I a miss the lecture la roy, especially in Tewa ni Atlantic long. To rek me inji late. Oni maju one hour thirty minute long. To rek me some wonderful lecturer. So lecture at the cut the hours in down last three hours. So one hour thirty minute maximum. Mo promise you, I'm a lecture in America. Hello, we here. Enjoy it. Go and live in Jersey. We can go and Whether we like it or not, Nigeria will break.
empty hand. God is powerful. Ojo gate, kojo gate, yoruba nation she dere dere, oke di arare, yoruba nation re o, oduro natan, yoruba nation, oduro gedegbe, gedegbe la wawa, oduro bankeke, oduro bankogbe, bi opa ronyo, ka kiri ka kiri, Nile America, iluti a te dosi oro ke o dua, o ni la yoruba, kole farasin, yoruba ne shanti duro na tanfa yeri, ni USA, lo baton, e be ilana o dua, la be o ludari o dogma agba banji akitoye, e kati USA, la be ishakoso barista adekun jo, un lo bi akede yoruba ne shanti kale kanka, agba jo wala fi iso yao, a je jia wako ugberu dori. Kani kapo yi yani yani. Bogbo ama odu anile Amerika ati lakba ye. In lakpe lati dara kwa mekbe wa yi. Ni www.ilanousa.org Tabi ki akwe wasi. 202-210-3251 Yoruba nation ke diara refayeri. Oju telegon. Yoruba nation is calling. Sons and daughters of Yoruba land and citizens of the world. Behold, the Yoruba nation has come to stay. The billboard is magnificent. It is beautiful. It is second to none. It is historic. Sons and daughters of Yoruba land. This is a clarion call for you to be part of history. Make haste. And join Ilana Oma Odua, USA, at www.ilanousa.org. Today, as tomorrow may be too late, Yoruba Nation is second to none. Call us today at 202-210-3251. Yoruba Nation, Oguadula Koiki Media bringing the world closer to your doorstep, 15th of June 2023, Thursday, 2 9 p.m. Have a very good afternoon. Thank you so much, every single one of you, without leaving anybody behind. Bye for now.